Alright, let's get right into it. Oh, because we're at the fucking... No, we're going to be against Jared at the fucking police stage. This guy sucks. I've chosen a really shitty time to end it last night. Because we're going to be sitting for like a two and a half, roughly, minute cutscene. I have tried to skip this particular cutscene. I can't. Believe me, I've tried. Right, so hopefully we can just go for the door. Yeah, I cut it. So let's just go through. Deal with us. You know what a cop is, new kid. Oh, here we go. Is a slave. Oh my god. Told the the minute the minute he says it's that, the, the fucking minute he says bigots. that, I'm pissed off. That mayor has been sitting in her office telling us we have to change our ways. The only way to have her removed was to raise crime in the streets, and now cops are finally able to do things the old way again. Don't you see this is better for everyone? No, I I really don't. Holy shit, that scramble. What? You found the missing cat, but Lord Freedom Pals, we've got the police chief, top floor. What can I say? You kids have me by the balls. Almost by the balls. Ah, uh, shit. You know, not every prisoner we have here is black. Oh, no. We actually do have one white guy. Not the smaller fucker who I hate. This is a trap. I'm sorry, kids, but you left me no choice. You still looking good. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> hey kids, you want some candy? Oh fuck, it's Jared. You'll excuse me if fuck I don't my want life. To watch this. Oh, I don't want to be here. All right, hi on. All right, so like, my sister wanted to watch Elvis. I'm pretty sure Elvis or four. No, not four. Four is not out yet. Not yet over here. But like. Fucking Elvis. She did not want to see Minions at all. She was like, can I just go watch Elvis? Can I watch Elvis tomorrow? But my mom won't need all four of us there, so all four of us it was, so. I just love We're just gonna talk through Jared's whole fucking thing. So. Oh my god. Ew, 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 ew. I should have fucking, I can't fucking do shit. By the way, fucking nothing. Fuck's sake. How do kids like to see my famous foot long? So it's actually louder than I remember at the cinema, honestly. But we get we get Costa. Like you can get Costa in the way in. So we get Costa, we get hot chocolate. I get hot chocolate. My mother gets coffee. It's a pretty tough. But now let's see how you deal with my Yeah, fuck it's Jared's. I Fuck's sake. Never got Never mind. The movie was fantastic, we'll though. You, I absolutely I loved it. it. Thank you. God, protect me, AIDS. Oh my god. This is all going oh no. Exactly oh no. no. We're gonna. Plan. We're gonna do it, though. We're gonna need to kill him. Kill him. Kill him. Kill him. Yes. Thank God. So yeah, movie was fantastic. Just absolutely great. It's weird though. You see characters that appear later on the doing? in the, the other arrested? movies. Because this is like a prequel to a prequel. No. Shut up. No. Wrong. No. The movie I just watched on my laptop was a prequel to a prequel. Whatever. Anyway. Fantastic ah, movie. That was hardcore. I know. Alright, well that was pretty uncomfortable. I do not want to hear anyone say, like, what we should do with the body, because I don't know. Whatever they've got in the basement can't be worse than this puke. Tell you fucking wash. Anyway. Protect, serve, bang, bang. I'd see references to the this other movies and shot. would just immediately After point them out, though. Because, like, there was a Scarlet right Overkill That's lunchbox. Nice. Yeah, dick. You're a fucking dick, mosquito. Like there was a Scarlet Overkill lunchbox. Doctor Nefario was there. He works in a a record shop. Actually, what was that again? It's gonna come back to me in a minute. Would you shut up? I know. What was it again? Look at me talk, Tolkien. Oh my God. Anyway. So it was. I swear to God, I'm just gonna go sit in the morgue a minute so I don't have to listen to you talk. I mean, no offense, but you are very rude. 
Okay, what was it? It was a record shop d disguised as like an underground villain lair. Technically a lair. It's where they were holding interviews for the next villain, but like I'm watching one of them go, yeah, you're too young. How about you do something that impresses me and, you know, maybe I'll let you in. And I'm just like, okay, no offense. But if I had been, if I had been Belle, Belle Bottom was like her villain name. I fucking loved her. She was a good villain. I really, really liked her. But like, if I had been her, and this little, this little kid had stolen the very important stone that I had stolen off the guy I then backstabbed. You know, the stone's very, 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 very important. If the kid somehow managed to slip that out from behind me, that would have impressed me, and I would have let him join. That's all I'm saying. Oh yeah, so there is actually. Thanks for reminding me. So I got like, I got free chocolate bars, a pack of biscuits, and a bag of popcorn for this movie. I was like, the more prepared one and all I ate was the popcorn while I was there. I ate some of the chocolate when I was like watching the other movie downstairs like half an hour ago and that was it. Good day though. Huh? What was that? Hello? Hello, is someone there? No, I guess no one's there. Or else they would have said something. All right then. It's just me and you, Kitty. No one's gonna find us in here. Come on, give me that good stuff. Hey, stop it! Hold still. Oh, bananas! Cat why? Away. Why would you do all of this with the light off? Is what I'm saying. Sounds like the cat's getting into the toxic chemicals. What the fuck? It, what kind good. of actor is in? Let me let me actually count these. 15 Barbie movies and then Sausage Party. Oh no, I think they were. I don't know who it is. I'm just like looking at this while I scroll in Twitter while this fucking cutscene happens. Blast it. There's the gas. Raven's reaction to Heidi dating Cartman. Oh boy. Okay. Hell yeah. It was weird seeing Nefario younger. It's weird seeing Nefario. Fan, and Silas Ramsbottom. <laughs> <I'm not laughs> Look, I remember Silas is like no, the AVL leader the in the cast. second Despicable Me movie. It's weird seeing him younger. His hair was fucking weird, uh, by the way. I think the it was weird. But like, Gru aiming to get the moon finally, finally Dying makes again. sense. Because he really admired hard was it hard hard knuckles the yeah. super villain who fucking faked his death at the end of the movie which was fucking amazing so then is basically he told he told Gru, he gave him this little bit of advice shoot for the moon and he literally did that and knowing that having that backstory is fucking crazy oh my god Literally no one cares that you're dying. I saw a guy fake his death today in an animated movie. It was fucking crazy. I loved it. No, it was so funny watching Silas tell Gray, I hope you'll stay out of trouble. I'm like, yeah, but he won't. And then you end up kind of kidnapping him. It was so good to have like another Minions movie to get into. I loved it. They make this so complicated though, why? Oh, you didn't do all that, did you, new kid? I keep meaning to bring back other games, but then all I want to play is like South Park and Minecraft. And even then, all I want to play is this version of South Park. So my sister left, um, she didn't really leave the movie. She went to go to the bathroom, like, I think about halfway in. And I had to go and I just, l I didn't move an inch until after it was finished. Hmm. And after it was finished, it's like, I need to go. Cause I have, I have needed to go for like two hours. <laughs> so then I go 
And I came out, my family had basically ditched me. They hadn't ditched me. They were waiting elsewhere. I couldn't see them yet. So I went, I took a picture of the poster. I loved the poster for the movie. That's why I wanted the picture of it. I got my mum to take a picture of me with the poster though. So that's the one that I like posted. And it's one of the first photos I've seen where I don't really hate myself on it. I don't know, because sometimes I don't really like doing full body photos because I don't like how I look and I have a few of them. But that was really nice to see. What time is it? Uh, two minutes past seven. It's locked. New kid, find the key, hurry. It's locked. Oh, of course it's fucking locked. I want to go find the key. Did I not get the key? <laughs> no, I didn't. That's on me. Never mind. <laughs> okay, I got, go. I got the key now. I got the key now. One of us could probably just have punched down the gate, but whatever. Whatever. Yeah, yeah, sharp nigger out. Oh, boy. Black goat of the woods. Blessed be us, your faithful servants, the destroyers of light. Yeah, yeah, sharp nigger out. Black goat of 1,000 morbid young, draw down the moon and extinguish the sun. All right, let him go. No! Uh, sir? Fuck huh? these guys, you know? Oh, I see. I guess because cops feed African Americans to an elder god, they're racist. Yes. Chub Niggeroth is an outer god, kids, who must be appeased and- Sir, I've had that, like, experience before the before, but then I look at this one. But I suppose- And I don't mind- I did not know what to do with my hands, though, as the picture got taken, so I just, like, did without natural. <laughs> I don't hate it, though. It's one of my favorite pictures now, and I'm just really glad that we win. Because we were gonna make it, like, a movie night thing at home, and- probably just like rent it to watch it but then when well, my brother asked me if we're going to the cinema and I said no we're not going to the cinema so I said to mom he thought we were gonna go with a fucking cinema <laughs> and then she's like you know that's not a bad idea and I said you want to go to the cinema to watch this because like I can contribute Super if you bad. need me to contribute but I'd, I'd love to go see us in the cinema honestly so fuck we this, went go. yeah fuck this let's go okay, check another one in. Such a good movie. I will sing my praises about it for forever. It was so fucking good. And my sister did not shut the fucking bedroom door right, so I'll need to go do that at some point. Next cutscene, I'll do it. Fuck that. I also say that. Well, no, don't say what you're gonna say. It's gonna come off as really, really fucking bad. I'll pause. Thank you. You thugs have no respect for the best. You know how to take a hit, diabetes. You have no I respect for people. I'm counting on you, partner. Ow. We got these guys. He goes like, ow, and I haven't even hurt him yet, technically. Diabetes coming through. And that really hurt. My friends are watching. Nice. Oh, I'm up? Okay. Kill the unbelievers! Hey, yeah. Well, not combatant, but will prevail. Yeah. Let me get back here. We need to put him and Craig like front and center. You know, the punchers. I'm okay with that. There we go. Okay. Oh, all right. The movie was really weird. There was like, okay, these six villains. Can I remember what their group name was? No. There was six of them. Like, that was in the title. And they were all after these special zodiac powers. That's what they needed this stone for. They would go over... It was a Chinese New Year, and this was really important, because it's, like, tied into the zodiac thing. 
right? So, they wanted basically the power of the stone to activate midnight on the Chinese New Year. They did actually do it. That's where I was wondering why, like, Kevin Stewart and Bob, those three minions, turned into animals. Now we have answers for that. It was really good, though. Yeah, he did. <laughs> oh, shit. We are definitely on the same page when it comes to punching villainy into submission. You so are. Great job, you two. God, what's he even doing? He stands there and just waves the poor cat around. <laughs> I didn't notice that until like right now. Now I feel bad. I'm here to protect thee, my queen. You are disgusting. And weird, actually. And I can't wait to kick your fucking ass. No. But you get the job done. You do. Okay, dial, okay, dial it back. Yeah, dial it back. Good news, everybody. It's my turn. Craig, you wanna go ahead. We're just doing this because it's funny and we can like kill two of them. But if someone actually dies during this, I have so many regrets. Let me shut the door. Hang on. Hang on. Okay, shut the bedroom door. Okay, the bedroom door shut. I fucked up my seat in though. Ah, oh, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. okay. I'm sure we'll have to sort it out shortly. What? No, you won't. I'm using this to buy myself some time, just give me a sec. Give me a sec. Okay. Okay. Hang on. Okay. What do you want to do? Nice. Let me hold up. Hell yeah. Off, 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 off. Got it. Stand here. Get excited. Human kite clear for takeoff. Nope. There we go. You're up, ass blaster. All right, now we just set and wait. Set and wait, everybody. Here we go. Somebody wake me when it's my turn. Okay, just give it a fucking minute. God, this thing's gross. There. Sometimes those villains just need a little nudge. And Super Craig, if I nudge, you may punch the shit out of. Yeah. Um, okay. Uh, just... Done. Not today, Jeff. You shit. <laughs> that is my favorite line, honestly. And that's how it's done. Yep. I can't believe you little niggas did it. Thank y'all. I feel like I'm finally safe in this 
this shithole town. You're welcome. Who are you? Oh my god. That was the so called the little girl. Da -da 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 -da. Whoa, whoa, wait! What's going on? Where are you taking that cat? Oh, uh, yeah, sorry, Freedom Pals. There's a uh, certain intel we have that we can't share with you. You know, it's classified. That's because we've been tricked. Ah, fuck. Ah, fuck. The kid played us, Freedom Pals. Wanting to join our side was a ruse. What? Yeah, yeah. they kind of totally fucked you guys over. Sorry. They followed our lead to the police station and now intend to get a hundred dollar reward for that missing cat. Well, all is fair in love and war, Freedom Pussies. <laughs> I love when you call me Freedom Pussies. You assholes! We're the ones that stopped the police chief's evil plan. We deserve uh, that reward. Oh yeah. Te technically, that was me. We will. Civil War Three is going down. That's it, new kid. We're gonna rip you apart. No, Mysterion. We won't fight the new kid. They will. All right, new kid. Time to die. Let's get this little shit. So, like, I know the trend about, like, the new Minions movie that, like, you know, teenage boys would, like, go in dressed in suits to go Friends along with that meme me thing. Me okay, so, there was a group oh, there, and they didn't have the suits, but they did start so clapping. They would clap at the, the beginning, they were clapping at the end. Ah, oh, shit, 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 shit. Hang on. Oh, definitely. There we go. Take it away. Oh shit, that'd be helpful. Alright, anyway. Now I'm more powerful, bitches. Haha. Haha, my trusty helmet must shield me from your mental powers. Okay, but then why didn't my brain get hacked? Sorry, Chaos. Unfortunately, Dr. Timothy can only dominate so many minds at once. There was some moments. Like, we actually had a Piss and Boots trailer come on before the movie actually showed. And Piss and Boots does that whole thing where he, like, gives you the little eyes of cuteness. Like, big round eyes are just so adorable like the whole vegan face thing going on so minions did a thing that was kind of like that it was really funny and like it would it started off with one and slowly turned into like i think all of them just doing like the big sad eyes to get whatever they wanted oh you guys fucking suck you know that you fucking suck Fine. Uh, we'll be fine in a minute. Oh wow, that was so weird. That's not cool, Timothy. I'm back on Team Butthole now. And you're gonna be too. Congrats, stupid friend. Ah, uh, get out of my head, Doctor Timothy. I'm with you, Butthole. Swooping in on a breeze of justice. She deserves to smack the shit out of him once. He made a crucial mistake when he failed to control the bear. Flo has fallen. Timmy, stop raping my mind, goddammit! Alright, Batho, let's do this. Okay, so we could probably just tag Team Mysterion. And then I'll just, like, Moses heal everyone. That seems like a plan, right? It's easier to do that than just whatever the fuck else, I don't know. Ready to suck. 
or we just do something else. I'm so angry at you, you hit yeah. Did I miss something? Well fuck, new kid. I guess we'll I don't think I was paying attention to my what? You raped a lot of minds today, Dr. Timothy. Now you're gonna pay. Can we reach any of them? No. Okay. Fine, fine, fine. Oh wait, we can. Do that. Set tag to Mysterio on here and find right now. Oh! Weird. Alright, everybody, tag team those two. Yeah, you're screwed. Okay, I think we're gonna take down you, and then we're gonna heal everybody. Pretend that really hurt. My friends are watching. Don't need to pretend. I know it really hurt. Beware, evil, for from the sky comes a kite. There we go. Okay, that's everybody back. We're gonna do the heal, and then we're gonna do whoever I think is strongest. Me thanks. Moses heal time, bitches. What kind of two black magic is this? Cartman. Shut up. At the Hall of Super Best Friends. Let all debts be forgiven and all slaves free. <laughs> so we're watching the f the first Minions movie. Scarlet Overkill, right? Like the first female villain, very positive influence. All that. I fucking I love her, honestly. She's evil, but she's also fucking perfect. I don't know. Six of okay, where's he going? Well, shit. Alright, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. We gotta see. We gotta see, we're gonna see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Free 5 1 or for free 9, did that say? There. Thank God for summons. It's coming right for us. The summons are so much better to use in this game and even even if they don't like bring an instant kill to your enemies, it's just so much easier. Thanks, Uncle Jimbo. <laughs> Alright, so someone still has an ultimate. We can't really reach right Get now. Aside, coon friends. Daddy's home. No, oh my god, you can't- oh wait, you can. Go ahead. Just whatever we can do. <laughs> I love how he's like, oh no, when this happens. I'm hoping to complete the game and also do the Morgan Freeman fight. So then next time I play, we can just like immediately go into the Steve Harrington final girl era. And oh fuck, he's about to have a turn, everybody. Is there there's nothing else we can use? Well fuck. No, really, just take all the time in the world. Oh Cartman, this is why you don't get any fucking protection. I just leave you to fend for your fucking self. Get that traitor. Relax. We all get a little confused sometimes. At least they're confused, not fucking hypnotized. Really? I'm not. No. Which one is that one? I really do not need them confused right now. Oh, that'll do. Never mind. That's a really fucking strong one I've found. I want to use it against Morgan Freeman again and see if that'll like do anything. All right, perfect what battle happened? over. How'd my lip get busted? Where the fuck did Classy go? Dr. Classy Timothy. fucking left like five minutes ago. You fucking animal. Oops. He was trying to help I didn't mean to punch him that hard. You guys started this war, not us. You don't fucking understand. 
Dr. Timothy was working on a way to save all of us! Freedom pals and coon friends! What? Oops. Easy, Doc. You've taken a lot of hits. Wow, this is your guy's base? This is fantastic! It is actually fantastic. Oh, my, my. Yeah, I mean, Coon Lair has a lot of cool stuff, too. But yeah, this is cute. Dr. Timothy was never your enemy. He was trying to help us all. But how? With this. Oh my god. Hey, oh my it god. Out. It was Dr. Timothy's passion. He worked tirelessly. Holy crap. A franchise plan that involved everyone. Each hero got their own movie and TV series. Every hero mathematically equal to the other. Jesus. Smart. This is incredible. Timothy almost worked himself to death trying to come up with it. So while we were out trying to stick it to you guys, Cartman's fault. Timmy was actually trying to include us. Yeah. And then this kid nearly killed It was Cartman's fault the entire time. Fuck you guys. There's a hundred dollar reward for this cat. That ugly, mangy thing. But not anymore. If we proved anything tonight, it's that we are the best when we are all together. It's too late for that. We all started as one team. We all wanted to be superheroes for the same reason. To sell our franchise and make millions of dollars. Let's be one team again. I agree. Come on, guys. No more civil war. Let's get the reward money for this cat and use it together for one franchise. Yeah, let's do it. All right. But we're calling it Freedom Pals. Uh -oh. Freedom Pals. <laughs> so, like, Timmy is sort of the leader. Here we like, go. He has like, such an issue with us. Yes. Mm -hmm. Well, I think it's awesome. Honestly, Freedom Pals is a way better name than Coon and Friends. Freedom Pals. Freedom Pals. I'm super cool with this. You and are so, so not cool with us. We get the reward money for scrambles, and we use it to kickstart Timmy's franchise plan. Together, Freedom Pals, Retribution, but with inclusion! Fuck yeah, you guys. Let's do this. <laughs> yes. Oh, you know what this is? You know what this basically is? After Stranger Things 3 when you think everything's mostly fine and then it's fucking not. But then... Yep. God, this is like Stranger Things Volume 1, like Season now, 4 Volume 1 versus Volume 2. Day off, day off right. Good, Good morning, morning, South Park! Park. An attack, An attack on the, on the SPPD, SPPD police, police station last, last night had left citizens in shock and disbelief. With prisoners on the loose and policemen in the hospital, one member of the Chamber of Commerce has had enough and is announcing his bid for mayor. Oh, uh, here we go. Oh my god. We can free ourselves from the anal terrorism that has been forced upon us. My name is Mitch Connor, and I endorse this message. Well, okay. Yeah, put your Steve clothes on. Don't you Steve the Hair no Harrington. What to do next? Okay, bye. Like you haven't been given any direction and you're unsure what's even going on. It's because you've been trying to find yourself in the wrong way. Knowing your sexual identity or race or ethnicity, that's nothing compared to knowing who you are spiritually. Go to the pond, my child. Someone is waiting for you at the pond who will finally help you find your true self. Welp, okay. My, my true self, huh? Wow, that's so interesting. And apologies, hang on. Freedom pals, all freedom pals report to base immediately. I repeat, all freedom pals to base. Can't go to base Somebody right now. Fast pass? You know, I'm busy, I have other shit to do, and I just, I don't want to run out. Where am I going again? The lake? The lake. The pond, sorry. Stark's pond. There you go. Thank you. Psst. Psst. 
kid, over here. I've been watching you, and I believe we can help each other. Have you heard of the super best friends? Well, it is I, Seaman. Oh my gosh, that is still an awful, awful name. To talk to fish and swim, it's Seaman. That Seaman. God. It's my job to help all creatures of the sea, and right now there is a gay fish who wants help getting his mother into heaven. I want to help the little gay fish, but all the other super best friends keep saying they're too busy. Will you help? Then swim down to the water's depth with me. Don't worry, my water defenses shall protect you. And so, the new kid dives down through the water, protected by seamen. No. Seaman! Down to where the little gay fish makes his home. Boo-hoo-hoo. Oh, boo-hoo-hoo, boo-hoo, boo-hoo. Do not cry, little fish. I have returned and with help. Oh, uh, thank you, Seaman. You really think you can help my mom get to heaven? It's Seaman, and yes, I do. This child has incredible powers. All right, if you get my mom into heaven, I will give you three million dollars and some jewelry. Just touch my little gay flipper, and we shall be magically transported to help her. Touching the gay fish's flipper, Seaman and his sidekick are transported to Valhalla, where another fish rides a unicorn. Oh my I'm God. here, Mama. Is that you, baby? It's me. We're gonna get you to heaven, Mama. Just hold on. This kid's gonna help us. Okay, baby. Whatever you say, you little gay fish. And so, semen sidekick had to oh, I hate that fucking part. A stream of rainbow unicorn fart. That's sea man again. This road leads right to heaven, Mom. Just watch out for those columns. So you're probably wondering if you hate it, why do you come and do it? Because like I don't know. It keeps making me think of pipe. And what is it again? Pipe dreams, pipe dreams, simulacra pipe dreams. I fucking hate that game, by the way. Um, and I kind of want to play it again, but to play it again, I have to do all this awful shit and basically try not to sell my soul, I'm pretty sure. That's the thing, like, you give hours of your life to that thing. Um... To like the fictional game and the game, you know, it's, it's freaky, I'll like take your life away from you. So let's say you lose against it, then you and your friend will probably die. Guaranteed we're going to lose. We're so going to lose. We're so going to lose. No, come on, we can't do this. Put this whole event on a gold disc yes, 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 yes! We got it! I was very shocked. I love you, Mama. I'll see you soon, baby. Oh my god, I'm so relieved. Wait, I'm so relieved. Thank God. Hold on a sec. So relieved. You have done very well, my child. Thank you, Jesus. Not you, Seaman. The kid. Seaman! Oh, yeah, right. Anyway. <laughs> You had no reason anyway. to help gay fish, my child. Oh, dear and God. You did. Kid had every reason to help me. I'm a lyrical genius, voice of a generation. I see that you were trying to determine your spirituality, my child. Allow me to help. There are good and bad in every religion, okay. my child. Which are you? Okay. Okay, I don't know what Steve would be. I'm just, I don't know. Because I kind of still want to. Chaotic. We're doing it. Fuck it. Fuck it. Agnostic. Atheist. Okay, you're a chaotic atheist. I'm sorry, it's so funny every single fucking time. Oh wait, I bet you want to sell me Jesus, right? Oh wait, hang on, yes we do, yes we do want something. No, stop looking bored. This is probably where they don't get the impression that I'm an atheist, because why the fuck am I taking selfies with Jesus? Good luck, right. My little chaotic atheist. Just guessing. Like they think I'm gonna suddenly fucking like pray to God or some well, shit and well, well. pray to Jesus. Sorry. Pray to Christ. They said. Transgender, bisexual, white, American, chaotic, atheist. A transgender, bisexual, white American, chaotic atheist. Everybody. We don't take kindly to your Steve Harrington. Let's welcome this thing to our I don't know what religion he is, but we're just going with like chaotic atheists because I fucking love choosing chaotic atheists. Okay. Call girl. 
Ah, fuck it, keep Welcome to America, motherfuckers. Now get the fuck out. Oh, oh fuck you guys. I'm gonna punch one of you. Oh, Ew, stop being fucking gross, bitch. God damn you. God damn you. Go down, stupid. Hey, look, it's Steve and Steve again. <laughs> fucking love you. Yeah, I saw that coming. You're gonna need some face face counseling after this. Got him, Wendy. Not a girl. Oh, I'm up. Okay. <laughs> I like our eyes. Good news, everybody. It's my turn. Mega Bomb Hut. Quit oppressing my belief system. So yeah, my mom hand it, hands me a tiny bag of Maltesers <laughs> when we're like in and we're sitting and we're waiting for the movie to start. I think the movie had just started, or it was it was like just like the whole opening credit scene. Um, but I just put the bag, I put the small bag of Maltesers in my bag. I don't touch my bag for maybe the next, I don't know, half hour, forty minutes, maybe even an hour. Right, and then I'm like, I'm gonna get the popcorn out because things are getting good, things are getting interesting, and I want popcorn. Somebody call for a fast pass. So I like, I bought this bag of popcorn at the supermarket. It said it was cinnamon, -like. it was sweet flavored. So I'm like, let's just let's just try it. Worst case scenario, we hate it. So we did like it. It was just me and my mom that had it because she was. She was the one who I was sitting next to, and my siblings wouldn't have fucking bothered. Plus, we were listening to songs in the way up there and the way back. They never played any of mine. No, it was just all about them. They kept fighting over the music. It was exhausting. Oh, hey, homie, it's me, classy. hey, classy. No problem. So I really, I really like the picture that I took with the poster that I got my mother to take. Cause like, she's like, are you really gonna keep your mask? I'm like, yeah, just take the picture, please. Cause like I found her, I went up to her. I was like, well, since you guys weren't there, I took a picture of the poster. I would have liked to get my picture taken like beside the poster. So she's like, well, come on, I'll, I'll do it with you. Which was really nice of her. Cause I was wanted to ask that, but I had no idea how to and my sister would have made fun of me. But we just go. We don't even tell my siblings we're gonna do that. So they're just standing outside. Thank God it's not raining like it was earlier. This was really fucking funny. Sorry. I'm being chaotic cuz I can. <laughs> I hope it's over to someone else's stream and I'm just I'm just like hello, hope you're having a good day. No. This was someone I'm gonna get to get bullied, aren't I? Someone who wanted to hurt us personally just translate to Eric Cartman. Speaking of, the beginning of Minions started out really, not really weird. It was awesome. So we had, we had one of the, one of the, like, the main sex villains. For the love of everything, I cannot remember. Like, I cannot remember what they called themselves. They were like, a group of sex. And I can't remember. But like... Or you will never see your parents again. And I don't know. Or else there'll be more of this. Where are they, fat ass? Where is who, human cat? The new kid's parents, where are they? How should I know? Because that's fucking you. You took the new kid's parents because you hate that we merged with Freedom Pal. That's not true. I want this mega franchise more than anybody. Tell him, Gat. You have five seconds, Cartman. I'm on your side! New kid, 
You believe me, don't you? I don't think anyone fucking believes you now. So the opening. The opening was like Belle. Belle bought him and like Okay, she goes about in this like mo what she has a motorbike, basically. She's trying to like escape the anti villain league. So she slips into this record shop called Criminal Records, which I was like, that's an iconic fucking name. So Criminal Records is secretly like her villain base with the other villains that she's in a group with. What she stole was the map to the Zodiac relic that they were after, right? So, Hard Knuckles is the oldest of the gang. So he's the one who goes and gets the relic. So they take the relic and they just leave him to die. And I'm pretty sure they thought he was dead and like he just was not so dead, easy. obviously. Go to the place where people get their copy fix. Better hurry. Tick tock, tick tock. So basically, there's a lot of misunderstandings that occur. Nobody. What's the matter, fool? Afraid of a little chaos? So basically, somehow, well, obviously, Gru really wanted to be part of this Hello, sex group, um, and they wouldn't you? let him. So we decided oh, to take the Zodiac relic, and they didn't like that. Unfortunately, due to some confusion, he ended up losing it. So, That's Hard Knuckles real. kidnaps him. That's real good, new kid. Now uh, the now five su supervillains are I'm after him. Um, the minions are trying to get him back. It's Going not easy. So you got like Kevin Stewart and Bob and then you got Otto. So Otto's going after the relic. The other three are trying to save Groot from his kidnapper. It's just, it's so wild just how it all ends considering how it mostly is, honestly. Think you can outsmart a shitty ninja? So also like Kevin on the phone when like Hard Knuckles Don't calls to make a ransom a and it's like it's one of those I want to say 80s phones I'm sorry it's the only way I can describe it the ones that are like connected to the wall and they've got like the uh the cape the wire cable Everybody mad at you! Prepare to die! Sixth graders just wanted to look at boobs and you killed them! Okay, the sixth graders are the, are the other thing. Like, genuine question, by the way. Thank you. Alright, so good news. This is finally fixed. Because usually I can't see over here until I've moved someone name. over here. Show me naked pictures of your moms and we might go easy on you. Why Show me a naked, naked picture of yours. That's your problem. Really? Show me one of yours. <laughs> this is why shitty walk better restaurants and stupid ways. Yeah, yeah. Say cheese. You need to use enemy momentum against them next time. What, what in the hey now? Revenge. That's why you don't see the child. Alright, so like Hard Knuckles had these really, really, really tough minions, right? Like tougher than the minions themselves, kind of tough. They were very strong, muscular guys who all got defeated by a kung fu master, so I think that's how we ended up firing them. But then he just takes in Gru to, you know, be his new helper and then just ends up mentoring him in, in villainy. Which I love that. I love that they just became a villain duo. Now that's how you kill children. And at some point, will the five come by? They destroy the house, trying to look for them because they think they think Gru still has the relic, which he he doesn't. And so Knuckles and Gru come back to destroyed house, and you know is that is that usual conflict scene in a movie? And like Knuckles gives up on him and tells him to go home. And Gru's just about ready to go home until he sees Otto with the relic. Problem! Yeah, Gru then gets...
captured by the villains and they kind of have the relic. The AVL show up and I knew when the AVL showed up that it would be too late and there would be that whole thing. So the Zodiac thing did actually happen. Like they did actually. Like one of them became a dragon. One of them became a snake. Those are the only two I can remember. One of them became a bull. It was like that kind of, you know, thingy. The movie was really great though, even if I'm terrible at talking about it, but it was so good. My lord, it's me, buddy. A place where death comes in all shapes and sizes? What, what could it mean? We've got to solve It was nice to be able to go to the cinema again, because last time the fam went, I didn't join, because they went to go see the new Top Gun movie. And I'm not seeing like any of that stuff, and I'm not really interested in it. For now, just do what he says so he doesn't get suspicious. I was very excited to find out we'd actually go to the cinema to see like the new Minions movie. My sister did not want to, but yeah. She has the offering of free coffee and treats. So, oh Freedom my god. I think I need to sell stuff. Some new items because you're way cooler than the other customers. It's very oh, quiet in there. So oh my me. god, no. Fuck you. They are so embarrassing, honestly. Moving on. Oh, looks like I'm gonna catch me some. The fourties. I just overused that every opportunity. Bitch. Shocked to see no reason girls here. Wow. So much walking. So I need to do this to us. It's so much walking. Oh, fuck's sake. Fish. That's what I'm saying. Sure, you don't understand it. How could you? Uh, 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 gay fish be gay fish? I run. I it's run. I run. That's my great challenge. That's the weight on Come my shoulders. To, to bring your understanding is. to the people. Sounds you understand? Like shops, well, but which I, one involves uh, But how could you? I am literally here. Oh, my God. So, you stopped my widow, huh? You're not as dumb as I thought. Oh, my God. See standing over there? Take a selfie with him. Do it now. Your mom is going to Jesus, fuck. Okay. Crime fighting's not a game, vigilante. You're gonna get somebody killed. <laughs> Fuck off. You're getting close, new kid. But to find me, you're gonna have to solve one more riddle. I am a place where seats hang from chains. Oh, part desert, part jungle. Oh, you where suck. See what I mean? I walk all the way across town for this shit. Then I have to walk all the way back across town. My sister left the bedroom door open again because she sucks. Oh my god. Hang on. Sorry. So. The movie was great, honestly. So great. Here, kitty, kitty. Oh, here, forthy, forthy. But it unlocks a memory from school that I barely remembered until today. And it was like when I was I was still in primary, we did a lot of focus on like the Chinese New Year and all the zodiacs. Mostly us figuring out what our zodiacs were. Mine was the sheep. I remember that much. It was a wild time. See, I mean You're so just the creep we've been looking for. 
Yeah, well, we're going to keep fucking looking. I'm busy. Ha! Ah, messed. It's like he texts with such confidence and he messes. You messed! How could you mess? He was revealed in front of you. How did you solve my riddle? God, you're so smart. Wow, I'm so jelly. All right, you see that woman there? Go talk to her. He, he told me if I didn't do what he said, he'd do horrible things to my patio. Get a selfie with her. Do it now. I'm sorry. He. <laughs> he said he would poop on my patio. What was I... <laughs> that should just about do it. Sorry, kid. I have what I need now. See you around. New kid, I got him. All of his messaging has been coming from the community center. On it. You heard her, Freedom Pals. Everyone get to the community center now. Come here, Forthy. I'll show you how to pop wheelies. <laughs> need to get somewhere. <laughs> Hey, quickly! Get, get going, new kid! I wish they'd done, like, like uh, the boss titles for, like, Cartman's, Cartman's franchise, but also the Freedom Pals one. Like, when we were still enemies with them. I don't know why, that would have been very, very cool. Where's everyone else? Doesn't matter. There's no time. Let's get this fat turd while we can. All right, one, two, three. Oh my God, look. Where, where, where? If it isn't the Freedom Pals and their newest recruit. Dun, dun, dun. What have you done with the new kid's parents, fat ass? Nothing yet, but when I'm finished with you, I can't say they'll be exactly safe. This has gone far enough. We end it now. The only thing about to end is you, Mysterio. We aren't gonna fight you, Carmen. Now put your stupid hand down and stop playing games. We have to stop him, guys. We've got all the <laughs> That is such now. a funny we'll picture, though, just looking at it. We'll see about that, motherfucker. All right, yeah, we will see about that. To kill Mitch Connor? We'll fucking kill him. <laughs> Mitch Connor's enemy card is just. I love that. I love that one, honestly. Stop Mitch Connor, guys. Try not to hit Sorry, me. excuse me. Fuck him up, new kid. I was listening to like sad TikTok How sounds today, so. That's mostly because Stranger Things has inspired like some big angsty scenes. I should have brought Mysterio on. I didn't bring Mysterio on. I'm just an innocent hostage here. I am out of fucking ticket. Ow! Mitch Connor is over there. Yeah, we're aiming for over there, which just happens to be you. Here, let me drag in some assistance. Oh, I have to post a video of this to Instagram. Uh, damn it, I didn't kidnap Butlard's parents. That's bullshit. That is bullshit, oh, actually. Oh, figure out I'm on your side yet? He is basically back now. Yep, this calls for call girl. Stand there. No password is too complex for call girl. Your coon friends don't seem very friendly towards you now, Keen. Just shut up, Connor. Damn. Are we done here? Yep. Wow, you did it, guys. You beat Mitch Connor. Oh my god, there's literally five of us in that grip. It's literally just like that. Where are they? Where are the new kids' parents? <laughs> You'll never know. Potter, no! Shit, he's gone! Come on, we're taking this fat piece of shit back to base. <laughs> what fat piece of shit, human cat? The only way we're going to get Carmen to talk is to torture him. Yeah, sometimes torture is the only answer. You're gonna torture me? For what? Everyone get back to Freedom Pal's base. We have to make this shithead talk. What are you talking about? Guys, it's me, the king! With this. Oh, this is way fun. So. We're gonna go through the lab. We're probably I'm hoping to finish the game. But if I finish the game and do the Freeman fight, like after that, I'm gonna end. Somebody call for a fast pass? 
Because that would be a lot of fighting. It's a lot of fighting when you do the DLC stuff, so I don't want to like do the end of the game plus the DLC stuff because I know I'm not going to be out for that. I'm doing Minecraft again tomorrow. Um, and I do want to do some ship building, but I want to go and take more pictures of the one that I want to build and then work off that and then maybe do it, I think. We're not doing the half and half one, we're just going to do like the one and one, honestly. You're gonna talk, Cartman. New kid, you're going to have to make Cartman talk. What? What are you gonna do with that? You'll see. You guys are wasting your time. I'm the coon. Torture doesn't work against me, remember? So what? I, I just have to watch you eat? Is that it? I'm not, I'm not afraid. Eat that. Hey, I got an idea. Why don't we start looking for the new kid's parents? Then why don't you freaking tell us where they are? See? It, it doesn't even faze me. Is that a cuttlefish? Oh, no, I, I prefer salmon myself. No, oh, back. Not, no, not even a little bit. I can gobble those parts up. See? Mm -hmm. Hey, I, I got an idea. Why don't we start looking for the new kid's parents? No, oh, no, no, no. No, those parts don't bother me at all. Hit him again. That's my fault. Oh, Ew. Well, I guess we're done here, huh? Can someone reach around and get this knot? <laughs> oh no, you're not gonna eat that vomit-covered broccoli. It's oh, oh yeah, that's pretty gross, you guys. Oh god. Yeah, you guys might as well give up. Not... <coughs> oh, no. oh wait, 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 you guys! Oh my god! Oh, the, the cats! There you go. Cats! I just remembered, Connor. I think the, the fart jarred my memory. The, he said something about making cats more powerful than... than th yes, that's it! He must he must want to genetically alter the cats! The genetics lab, Dr. Mephesto. Yes, that must be it, Cass! <laughs> Fuck you! I should go back and do that again. Sorry. I am busy. I'm busy. Give me a minute. Give me a minute. Give me a minute. Give me a minute. Okay. Sorry. 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 Da da da. I mean, this is like a break, but like once we hit the cutscene. The inside the lab, I'm thinking. So, that is not close enough. Damn it, sorry. See you, new kid. Jimmy, come back, come back, come back. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I need to get somewhere. Better run fast. <sighs> That's how to try it out. Catch you later. I was rewatching Jack Set to Kai play Hello Neighbor recently, right? This is really funny. It reminds me how much, like, despite me having bought that game, I never want to play it because I'll be terrified of it. I don't do well with horror games or horror movies or really anything horror related. I kind of want to play it only because I bought it and I don't want it to be like a waste but I don't know. All right, the new kid's here. Come on, new kid. I'm here. Can I help you? Yeah, hi. We signed up for the tour. Ah, uh, yes, the night tour, correct? Uh, yeah, we're a little early. Well, I'm afraid for safety purposes, the tours are only offered from 10 p.m. to midnight. What, just to be extra spooky? It'll be worth the wait, my friends. See you tonight. Shit. Well, now what do we do? We'll just have to wait. We can't afford to let anyone else go in or out of this gate. Oh, well. We're just gonna have to wait here till nighttime. Okay, how far away is that? Uh, about six hours. All right, just wait six hours and we're good to go. <laughs> 
Oh, you can't expect us to wait six fucking hours. Do we look like people who would wait six hours? Okay, cool. This sure is gonna be exciting in six hours. Shut up, Scott. <laughs> Did anybody bring any uh, snacks or anything? Yeah, we should bought snacks. <laughs> you should have, and you didn't. Oh God. Okay. How long now? Oh my God. Right around six hours still. Stands Jeez, me what? though. Like Tolshed is just like me. I can't deny that. Have yet to tap the full potential of your time-bending ass. Then why don't you help Something me, Morgan Freeman? Something that your ability could possibly make time pass more quickly. Please, quickly. You see that AC fan over there? Right there, behind you. Love Wendy and Scott. They're just like, the left side, they're forever just prepared right here. If you fart into that fan, the oscillation of the gas will filter it through the expansion valve. I'm just messing. Pressurized refrigerant inside the condenser coils. It's just been... Round and round and round we go around no and around we go sense, around and round and round we go around and around we go. How did people watch Stranger Things 4 and not see that Eddie had a crush on Steve though? How did, how did you miss that entirely? Holy shit, dude! What the hell just happened? Oh, Me. Dude, it smells like crap. Well, looks like it's night time. Everyone regroup. I was here for the tour. Ah, yes, come in. God, Mr. Now, I want to go first because I'm competitive. God. We went to the supermarket before oh, so we went to the cinema, obviously. Huh? Well, and I had this whole competitive thing where it's like, oh, I'm going to get no. my treats first oh, and oh, yeah. try to make I it out before they do. Yeah. And I went to like the self scan well, while they I'm went so to one of the, you know, the ordinary tells. <laughs> so then Can I did make it out first, just barely. It was funny. The answer was yes. Oh my and now we've been able The to answer should have been don't baller. Everything you can imagine. Just saying. Yes, little boy. How does that help? Oh, you're one of the <laughs> cynics, huh? Well, meet me over here for the tour, and I'll show you how. Oh my God. Come on, don't be shy. We don't want I'm to miss get, the I'm getting in that tour tram, and then I'm leaving for like five minutes. So, anything happens while I'm gone, I'm gonna hate myself forever. Five minutes, Please I swear. Seat. You ever play that video game Half Life? Okay, here we go. Here you can see our greenhouse. Genetic engineering is helpful to grow larger tomatoes, onions, cucumbers. Fruits and vegetables with more asses means more nutrition for people all around the planet. What good does that do? Oh, you Bible thumpers are all alike. Don't play God, you'll pay for it. <laughs> Let's continue up to the second level, shall we? Another benefit of genetic science, of course, is combining animals. Like these donkey apes, bunny fish, squirrel donkeys, and more. Once we put more asses on these, we will truly be benefiting science. Will you please explain how that benefits science at all? What's your name, little boy? Super Craig. You see, Super Craig, once we know how to do things to animals, we can hopefully apply them to mankind. You think having more asses is impossible? I tell you it's not. You see, genetic engineering is not just for animals and veggies. We are working towards helping people as well. Here you can see genetic mutations of my dead son. Most people don't remember that I once had a young child named Terrence. Oh yeah, I remember that kid. I was wondering whatever happened to him. Terrence was killed tragically in town when some kids were playing around with a relic belonging to Barbara Streisand. Oh, jeez, I think that was us. So, you're doing this all as a way to bring back your dead son? Bring him back? Oh, well, of course not. I'm trying to give his dead body more asses so he can finally rest in peace. Now let's continue on to the fourth floor. Oh, fuck. Well, here we are. The top floor of the building and the end of our tour. What are these? These horrible, monstrous mistakes of science. Our new benefactor has asked that we genetically alter some of the local sixth graders and make them stronger and crazier. Okay, okay. Why the fuck would you do that? How do you mean? Why the fuck? Would you make genetically enhanced sixth graders? Calm down, Super Craig. How do you think we pay for all this? We have financial donors. 
Our latest benefactor has asked for this army of mutated sixth graders to protect his altered cats. What altered cats? Oh, right over this way. A wealthy benefactor named Mr. Connor has donated money to have stray cats enhanced with more asses. Our company can add asses to things at very competitive rates. The problem is that cats seem to become really aggressive when given more asses. They've proven to be quite deadly. Then why would you bring a bunch of kids up here? Look, there's nothing to worry about. This entire facility has a very complex security grid. Huh, that's never happened before. Oh shit, someone shut down the security grid. What do you mean? <laughs> Hello, Freedom Pals. What are you doing, fat ass? So, you figured out my little plan, huh, Freedom Pals? Think you can stop me? Oh, I have someone here who'd like to say hello, new kid. Go on top. Guys? Guys, it's me, the kid. Will you knock it off? Listen to me. Don't make any deals with this piece of garbage. He's an animal. Ah! That's enough out of you, kid. You've been a real pain in my ass, new kid. You should have known not to mess with Mitch Connor. Where the fuck are you? Mr. Connor, if you shut down the security grid, then everyone in this building is going to die. What? Sorry, Doc. Sometimes sacrifices have to be made for the greater good of the city. So long, Freedom Pals. Wendy, you had to ask what altered cats. You had to ask about the cats. You had to ask. Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot. All right, let's go. I'm sorry, kids, but we're probably all going. We're up to our next in the hole. Yeah, I'm a fan of the offensive tactic too. These things are so bitey and scratchy. I shot for their hairballs. Oh, thanks. I'm a distraction now. Is what you're fucking saying. Unbefucking leaveable. Fine. Big dramatic wannabe. Okay, I'm feeling a lot better about the door opening this time. I would not. Oh, I think this is it. Oh, no, I just let more cats. <laughs> I should mention that my test subjects have a crazed hunger for human flesh. Might have something to do with the ass adding process. Fuck it. Yeah, show no weakness. Let's try well, this. that was easy. Oh, I think this is it. Oh, no, I just let more cats. <laughs> Feel the wrath of human kites. <laughs> A 
amazing. We may actually survive. Kenny, are you ready to die? Well done, but I'm afraid you're still hopelessly out -assed. Then we just won. Oh my god, we just fucking won and he's gonna say that shit. Don't fucking scare me like that! Oh my god! My poor creatures. We must escape the lab. Maybe. Maybe we can go through some of the larger exhibits. This way, children. Okay, let's go. This one will definitely make the door open. Mutant sixth graders are on the loose. This was definitely not supposed to happen. Yeah, but are, are we surprised that it happened? No. It's okay. We'll be safe in the tour tram. Oh, the tour tram is offline. Oh, it's Somebody's ethical. Have to get to the CPU and hit the override switch. Where's the CPU? Down on the third level. Oh, it was silly to put it there, wasn't it? So somebody has to walk down to the third level and flip the switch? One, two, three, not it. Not it. Not, not it. it. Not it. Not it. <laughs> not it. Sorry, kid, but it really should be you anyway. Yeah, if you think about it, this is all kind of your fault. You fucking suck, you lot. You know that. Hey. Fucking saying that shit to me. Fuck you. This is like getting your fault. Your fucking uh, girlfriend wanted done. to see the altered cats, okay? She got us stuck in that room, not me. Technically, this is all Cartman's fault, by the way, so. Does your entire lap suck though? So complicated. It's like it's unnecessarily complicated. Me. Hey. Come here, little guy. Sorry. Scott has very interesting lines sometimes. I can see this ending well. Oh, geez, new kid. You're in quite a pickle. 
Thanks, didn't realize. Find the button, find the button, find the button, find the button, find the button. Button, 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 button. No! Button, 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 Push. Hide, 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 hide. And hide. And just sit here for a minute. My turn to see the bibs. I need a water anyway. School is for single ass homos. Uh huh. So any chance I can just get past them? Now? Can I just get past him? Fine, 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 fine. I tried. So. I told you not to block the boobs. You're not the boss of me. I'm trying to see boobs. Boobs are for sharing. Nothing else beating on you guys is really therapeutic for me. <laughs> Let's pound. Please, another funnel, huh? Why not? Okay, let's see, let's see. Can we do anything? No. Can do this. I did need that. Good. I'm going through a lot of stuff oh, right now. Sorry. I finally had the mic. I'll fight my asses with you, Forthies. Did somebody call for call girl? <laughs> God, I hate you, Forthies, so bad. Good, we hit you. Fuck all. Now nah, we know we're smart. there. I need to go. <laughs> Hell yeah, we do. I'm right, the good news is I didn't hurt anyone. Glad to be working with you too, call girl. Retribution, but with inclusion. All done.
That's it. He's cleared the way. The CPU should be right through that door, kid. We'll come down and join you. Oh my god. He's out of his mind. Carmen, yeah, you we know. Asshole. What are you doing? Connor brought me here, human cat. The sick son of a bitch. Uh, you shut up, Coon. Soon this town will be rid of you and all the Coon friends. We're freedom pals, fat ass. Yeah. You know what you're doing, Eric? Putting cat urine into people's drugs and alcohol to make them crazy? We want to know why. Mm -hmm. Yeah, why, you sick piece of... Uh, do I really have to spell it out, Coon? This city is sick. We both know it. There's only one time of year when this town is the way it should be. On Christmas. So I joined the Chamber of Commerce. <laughs> And use them to unleash my master plan. Master plan. Escalate crime in the city. Blame crime on mayor. Run for mayor. Get tons of followers. Clone new kid into a genetic mutant. Win election. Make every day Christmas. What do you think, pretty sweet plan? Can we re-reset one of those, Let's please? Take a selfie. That like stares at me as if the answer is obvious. Let me just let me put on a face of fucking outrage at my I'll fucking. I read a little longer. It's almost a shame that no one will ever know how perfectly my plan worked. Dude, you've gone too far this time. Nobody's gonna let you be mayor. Oh no, I've got all the new kids' followers. Every last one of them is now following me. Geez, that was smart. Eric, I know that Christmas every day sounds like fun, but it really wouldn't be. Fuck you, yep. Dr. Timothy. If you guys don't mind, I've got an election to win. No, no, no. Oh no. God damn it. Oh, there goes the main CPU. Darn it, why did I put that thing on a mobilized trap door? Oh, why, why wouldn't you? you? I'm afraid now someone will have to go clear to the ground level and call for the tour tram from there. All right, fine. Hurry up, new kid. We gotta get out of here. Yeah, new kid. Stop wasting time. Oh, fuck you guys, honestly. <laughs> God, if I have to listen to Clay, I can't even. Oh wait, there we go.
Looks like you've run into mutant sixth graders. Oh, and they look hungry. Don't get eaten. Very motivational. Alright, let's go. We need to deal with free waves. Be so. careful of the grates. I've designed them to be removable in case anything wanted to attack people from below. Typical. Ooh, you think you're tougher than me? Well, you're not. Yeah, I actually am, though. Here comes a shot. You won't see me coming. Nice. Okay, we're up to our next in butthole. That was shocking, actually. We went through two weaves before the vent change. Fuck me. I'll take this call, guys. You're gonna have to move after what I just did to you. Here comes the sizzle. Fuck yes. Today's been good. Like, we did movies today and we're going bowling on Friday. <laughs> oh, shit, no. Crazy. first in a while. They're trying to get DNA from your mother and I. You have to get me out of here. That computer is waiting for a DNA sample from your mother. Quick, she's in the next room. Go get mommy's DNA sample and bring it here. Hurry! Really? You're f for real? Okay. Let me just go speak to her quickly about all this. I'm sorry, sweetheart, but you have to finish the job. The only way out of here is to kill Daddy. I heard that! What the hell is wrong with you? Can I have a conversation with our child without being criticized? Oh, you're the victim again, huh? Oh, boy. Like you don't deconstruct everything I say. Okay, Mr. Never Wrong in his life. Go, go do it, sweetie. Go cut off Daddy's head. Hurry! <laughs> oh my god, okay. We're gonna do it anyway. What'd she say? Did she say how 
nothing is their fault like usual. I knew something like this would happen, and it's why I've told your mother to keep her fucking mouth shut! Fuck you! I told you if our child's powers were discovered, they'd try to harvest our DNA and make a genetic clone! You did fucking not! Listen, kiddo. The CPU is waiting for either of our DNA. Just trick your mom into walking over to it. Don't make our child choose sides! That's so unfair! I'm trapped inside of a tube thingy! My legs are broken and my arm is almost ripped off! I could bleed to death if I move! You hear that? Go get mommy's arm. That should do it. No! No, kiddo! Dad operates the laser! Stop! You're gonna kill daddy! It doesn't matter what we do. You're both gonna die. Ouch! No, please, baby. I've lost a lot of blood already. Please! I won't have you confused! She's the problem! Don't kill her! I've done nothing but love you! This is your last chance! Don't hit that last button! Where does do it? You have to cut off your father's head! I know it's hard, but it's the only way. The control panel is right on the table, sweetie. Ah! Ah! If you take my arm, it will kill me. Please, don't kill mom. Just the emotional manipulation. Hey, wait, wait, wait. Before you do this, before you do this, go ask your mom about what she's been putting in your food. Trust me. Just go ask her. You'll want to know this. Okay, okay, wait, wait, wait. Is this, is this about the medicine I put in your food? We only did it to protect you. Your dad knew it had side effects. Go ask him. Go ask your dad about the side effects. You gonna talk? I want to see how far I can push them. I want to see how far I can push them. gonna kill dad because i i can't i can't listen to her screams i'm sorry i can't maybe it's because i'm closer with my mother that's why i can't do it but i can't fucking do it you did the right thing sweetheart now get out of here and go get help Organic DNA sample accepted. Yeah, that time I was intentionally wasting time. Okay, Stanley can be mad at me about that if he wants. Where are these doing it before all of these are racked up to 95? Two more, huh? Two hundred.
You want to be powerful, you have to put the money forward for it. Hey, buddy. No. This time I think I'm mad at me, I really can't blow them. There. Hey, I should do it, let's go. Somebody get me out of here! Nope. No! Nope. Hey, you're that Forget it. There we go. See, that wasn't so hard, was it? What took you so long, new kid? You're just screwing around having fun? All right, Freedom Pals. We've got to get out to the town and tell everyone what Cartman is doing. I don't think so, guys. Dun dun dun. You came all this way just to die, Coon and friends. Freedom Pals. Pals. Coon and friends. Freedom, Freedom Pals. Coon and friends. Coon and friends. Coon and friends. Careful, guys. He's got some kind of super weapon. It's over, dun, fat dun, ass. Dun. We're going to tell everyone on you. Yeah, you hear that, Connor? You sick son of a bitch. <laughs> you shut up, Coon. We need each other. Don't you get it? I create the crime and you stomp it out. I am good for your franchise. Oh, fuck, I get it now. But then the new kid had to come along and try to stop me for good. Yeah. I had no choice but to have my own new kid built. What have you done, Eric? Simple. How do you stop a coon friend? By creating a massive, genetically altered coon friend from that hero's DNA. What? Oh, dude, that's so fucking base. What, what do you mean, Keen? Really? You're just gonna fight a superhero by creating a big genetic mutant from the hero's DNA? That's like every douchebag superhero movie ever. Yeah, because it's key. It's not key. No, no, it's cool because it's like the ultimate enemy. Oh, give me a break. Well, anyways, I wasn't able to finish getting the new kid's DNA, so I had to resort to cloning a different superhero. Which superhero? Oh, you're not gonna like this. <laughs> I'm back. I love how his first reaction is just to scream because same. Look at me, cousin Kyle. I'm a horrific genetic mutation. It's okay, cousin. We'll give you help. No, because I think the cellular restructuring has affected my brain and I have to attack you while I'll get a migraine. Prepare for battle, weaklings. Sorry, Kyle, but I'm filled with mutant rage and I have to destroy you guys. You don't have to. Hey, wait, hold everything. Is there a problem, Doctor? Ooh, okay. I just wish to observe a genetically augmented superhero squashing his tiny foes into a viscous red pace. Pretend I'm not here. Pretend I'm not here. I do that all the time. Let's try and finish before the hours. Oh. Right now we have 14 minutes. 14 minutes is enough to defeat this thing. Easy. Here comes call girl. Honing in on the signal. Oh, watch out for that toe. I actually have a blister that popped on. 
around and it'd get infected. Nice. Stew that troll in his own juices. It's time. That was uncalled for. Let you do it, Ted. Don't uh, try and give me upper hand. Try him. Ew. Oh, Are prescription and they're really expensive to replace. Oh my gosh. Fuck them up, new kid. Careful now. That's very unfair. Oh no. That's it. That's better. You yeah, are just like your Aunt Sheila. You know that? Take this. And you know what your Aunt Sheila is? A B I T C H. My nose feels a little funny. A, a big one. Call girl is making a house call. <laughs> Say cheese. That photo really paints a picture. When can I do the thing with the? You seriously don't know who you're poking, do you? Oh, time out, time out! I got a smudge on my glazy. Can't beat this yeah, thing. we're killing it. Hold off until daytime. His skin can't handle the sun. How are we gonna last till daytime? I don't know, but we we're definitely to gonna complete the game today. But like, if we're gonna do the DLCs, I'd rather just. New kid, you might want to do that part that rotates the Earth 180 degrees now. Set on. Oh shit! I should have done. Oh, fuck! I should have waited and just like punched the shit out of him. Damn it! You know what? Forget it. It's fine. I'm kind of regretting not getting the spray, but I just can't trust it. Fascinating. And you broke my fan. Thank you. Okay, I'm good now. I'm gonna kill all oh, shit. Again, okay? oh shit. Oh shit. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Oh, here we go. Uh, oh, be careful, Kyle. Fuck that. We're all gonna die. Yep, this calls for call girl. Okay, you know what? He wouldn't make it, Wendy. He just wouldn't. NBD, just saving your life. Thank you, Wendy. Oh, I'm sorry. It's little moments like that, like they're stupid little lines, but they mean so much to me. They mean it so much to me, honestly. God. It's stupid little lines like that, but they just mean the world to me, honestly. Stay back, stay back, stay back, stay back, stay back. We need to take some time out for healing. If he rounds on us, we are going to die. Oh my god, that really, really hurt. I'm having some minor nasal irritation. And I and I feel shitty because I'm leaving them to die. But if we die, we're we're gonna be useless. Back in business. Roughly. All right, you're fine. Oh shit! Fuck attacking. When you just died, and I can't find the maximum revives. Oh, for fuck's sake, you lot! 
ready to detonate some social media accounts. I'm sure this will wear off eventually. This is my time. No mercy. You don't fuck with call girl. Well, Kate's dead, but we made up. Yeah, it's kind of difficult for him to die when we're fighting his cousin, honestly. I'm not even surprised. With roughly seven minutes to spare. Nice. Knew we could do it. Get us the fuck out of here. Jesus Christ. Oh, oh, I think I got a pulled muscle. I don't think I should play anymore. Shift. Thank God. Were you okay? That last fart might have killed you. That was pretty amazing, dude. I've never heard anyone rip one like that. Well, I hope you've all enjoyed the tour. Maybe now you have a new appreciation for what genetic engineering has to offer. Oh, fuck You're now no. You're free to exit right through the gift shop. Gift shop? <laughs> Feel free to look around before enjoying the rest of your day. Perhaps you'd like to buy a I Survived Genetic Mutants t-shirt or purchase a photo of you enjoying the tour. Honestly, what Lots we could try to do. Let's get the fuck out of here. That was bullshit. Is like start a new game if we want it like not skip over the DLC stuff but like try and open up a new slot make right, that a new game apartment. like if we're up for that down. later I don't know what time is it it's oh shit oh no what is it Mysterion dude the new kid farted so big he made it next week what check your phones it's 10 days later oh, oh shit wait the new kid farted us to next week sorry screwed us way to go new kid yeah 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 today, and it's all the new kids fault here we have new kids fail you guys suck, by the way. You were a shitty, shitty, shitty friend group. An amazing franchise, but a shitty, shitty friend group. Freedom Pals, this is Mysterion. I'm at the mayor's office now. You have to come see this. It's really today, and you can spend me. The last time I remember going to cinema was to see the Birds of Prey Harley Quinn movie. We loved Birds of Prey. Seriously loved it. So when it came out on DVD, I jumped at the chance to get it in DVD, by the way. Because just I don't even use my DVD player anymore, but I have two boxes of DVDs. And there's definitely more around the house somewhere. And I would like to get rid of most of my DVDs. Most of. The ones I would keep would probably be Ratatouille, because I've had my Ratatouille DVD for years now. It's scratched up to hell. But it still works okay in the Blu-ray player, so I don't really yeah. mind. We won, bitches, we won! Yeah. Yeah. The whole mayor's office is blocked like a fortress! Who's How surprised? Can do that? He can do whatever he wants. He's mayor. Look, up in the window. Oh my god. I'm pretty sure I've done it before, like this jump to an empty save slot or something. Oh, yeah. I'll just, I'll figure it's it out when we, we get round to it. We can't lose. Face it, Kyle. Thanks to the new kid. Is oh yeah, thanks to no the new kid, of course. New kid. New typical. Kid, it is so Are typical of them. New kid. <laughs> that is There's Morgan Freeman. Some kind of time shift anomaly. I can only assume it came from your ass. Yes. Come to the taco shop. We have to fix this. You heard the man. All Freedom Pals report to Freeman's Tacos now. All right, let's go. Party in the evidence locker after we nab that vigilante. Vigilante's getting away, fuckers. It's like they always talk about, man. Like, I'm right fucking there. Do I look different in the daylight or something? Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
rewatching Stranger Things 4 today and seeing how long Nancy stared at Steve was really funny. Like when he's in the boat and that was hilarious. And then and then there's Max, who, like, when Lucas and Dustin are talking about Steve, she, like, grabs the binoculars, like, let me see, and then she just stares. And stares. And stares. <laughs> she was really funny when she wasn't being cursed. Anyway. Alright, the new kids. Morgan Freeman says he can help us stop Cartman. How do we stop him now? He's already been elected mayor. How do you, how the fuck do you think we stop more time travel, bitches? New kid. Your farts have sped up time. We have to somehow go back. Well, yeah, Stop obviously. Stop Connor from ever rising to power. This is the seven-layer quesarito chipotle beefy nacho supreme. Okay. The last time someone tried it, they farted so bad it created a wormhole that made time travel possible. So, you. Yeah. I have to warn you, friend. Once you eat the seven-layer quesarito chipotle beefy nacho supreme, there is no going back. Make sure you have everything you need before you eat this. Do you understand? Yep. All right, let's see. Everything up to date here. Let me see consumables. Macaroni pictures. Sex. So you're ready to eat the seven layer quesarito chipotle beefy nacho supreme? Now you must fart back in time to before Mitch Connor was sworn into office. You can do it. You just have to believe in yourself. I think it didn't work. Judging by this. All right, let's go. Merry Christmas! Happy oh boy. Yeah, it's Christmas, girl. Let's get fucked up. What the fuck? We're too late. The new kid sent us forward in time. To win Shit. Connor's already mayor. You have to take it back. Back to before this all happened. It isn't working. I think maybe the new kid has a fractured butthole. <laughs> a fractured butthole? That's ridiculous. Toolshed is right. We have to get the kid to a doctor fast. Be careful, new kid. South Park is a really scary place on Christmas. Oh, hey, boys. Merry Christmas. I'm so fucked up. I feel like it's been Christmas for a year. What'd they put in these drinks? Mr. Mackey, there's cheese in your alcohol. You have to stop drinking. No, but it's the holidays, boys. You guys know the wrong with a little drink on the... Oh, God, it's them again! Oh, shit. Now, don't be scared, y'all. We're simply here to celebrate the coming of our Lord and Savior. Oh, you evil little fuckers. You think we're gonna see through your bullshit? Everybody. Hey, look, it's the vigilante the mayor told us about. If we well, die, shit. We Yay! Yay! Oh, no, 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 you little satanic fuckers. Today is the last day of the rest of your life. Exactly, bitches. My Time to fucking die. The Brutalist Ultimate is fucking crazy, and I want to use that at every opportunity. Also, we could have easily beaten them like this. That one said, you want to attack them for that? Actually, no, we couldn't have beat them like this. It would have been fucking impossible. That really warmed him up. Oh, Foxy, your dark magic is just excellent. Hail Satan! 
This is definitely more Damien than Satan. Like, more Satan's son than Satan himself. Most like is one. Satan's dead. Not yet, but he will be. <laughs> Two. Satan just doesn't seem like the type of guy to do something like this. I mean, he's evil, but he doesn't seem like this level of evil, right? What was awesome in like Minions 2 was like watching Gru and he would say to the other kids, I want to be a super villain, and they'd laugh at him. And I'd be like, well, he becomes the greatest. Like one of the greatest. And he may retire from being a super villain, but he still becomes like really, really fucking good. So it's like getting to see like the full backstory that we didn't see much of before and then we get to see even more of it but like the way they tracked him down and put on this whole emotional show so he would hire them was so funny. Sorry. Hey look it's Santa Claus. Santa Claus? Well, now maybe we can eat his flesh. Hail Satan! Oh, oh fuck you, you guys. Again, huh? Yippers. Gonna kick the shit out of you. Let's go, bitches. Well, Shucks, we weren't expecting Santa to show up. Whatever will we do? We're in a bit of a bind, Rabbity. Don't be sad, Barry. Shucks, I can just sacrifice myself. Hooray! Oh, I always hated them for that whole sacrifice yourself bullshit. About to go to town on your ass. Get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. Kill it. Kill it. Merry Christmas, asshole. You always gotta take out the healer, because otherwise the rest of it is gonna be impossible. Another puddle, huh? Why not? Right, hire in some help and just punch the shit out of one of them. Ooh, nice shot. Thank you. You get like really up close and personal. But it does help. Kids are so cruel. Isn't that swell? Right, the good news is mine can then be used as a decoy against Barry. And I know it I know I shouldn't probably for myself in the line of fire, but still. Yo, gross. Get Barry. Barry, Deary, and the healer are like the big ones that I'm trying to get rid of. So we're just gonna work in doing that. And that's exactly why. Oh my god. Actually, don't stand there, she'll fucking kill you. Stand here. Burnt fur, technically, but okay. You won't see me coming. It's only gonna get nice. We killed one of them. Yay! Big fucking deal. Just gotta kill that stupid little healer, and then we can go to get there some. Yeah, fuck no, you're gonna do Satan's bedding, a little shit. Alright, who can we attack? Who can we attack? Can only attack them? Can only attack them. Fine. There. Oh, I don't really care. Healer? Healer. That's one less creature staring. Fuck you, bitch. Let's see if your screen is nice and salty. All right. The good news is she'll only attack us. I hope you kids aren't squeamish, cause things are about to get graphic. <laughs> Don't move. You're already turning black and blue, or is it white and gold? Nah, done. I like our eyes. I want to punch the shit out of someone. This might get ugly. <laughs> We're really good with these cutters now. Try that after we nibble out your eyeballs. 
We're gonna get Deary next. We're gonna aim to kill her next, because honestly, she's fucking annoying and I hate her. Now everyone can just move over there and attack the shit out of everyone. I'm gonna punish a Deary. I wanna see her brilliantly. I can. Oh, see, see what I mean? This one's fucking powerful as shit. Okay, you know what? It was close enough. It was closer than any of my other attacks would have gotten me. So, you know what? I'm totally fine with that. Thanks, Wendy. We're just slowly working our way over. God, I've not got a scratch on me. Oh, I sure didn't want that for Christmas. It's healing people. I'm so good at this. Oh, harder, master. Bait me harder. Ew. Get, oh get up. All done. Nice. Thanks for your help, Santa. You're welcome, kids. Now, what the fuck is this all about? We're sorry, but we're trying to go back in time. But the new kid has a fractured butthole, so we're trying to get him to the abortion clinic. No, I the abortion all clinic? Right, You're taking me to the abortion me. clinic? Jesus Christ. Get moving to the abortion clinic. All right. Well, look at us all just going to the abortion clinic. Totally not weird. You guys know we are four males going to the abortion clinic, right? Like, you're aware of that? Okay, whatever. Just saying. Hey, stand back, kids. We got a lot of abortions today. It's Christmas. We need a doctor to look at our friend's asshole. Let me guess. So I found that one Christmas episode, that, like, with the woodland critters. The mayor has to be stopped. We know how to do it. The mayor? That scumbag made the town the shithole it is today. We can put a stop to it. Please, just look at our friend's ass. Yeah, it's fractured, all right. Can you fix it? <laughs> well, I put a splint on it and a little sling to take pressure off Fractured the butthole. <laughs> I love how they, like, found a way around that. You can do it, new kid. Because obviously you can't name the game something like that, but they, they found a way to do it. Kind of, anyway. Let's see the difference. Let's see the difference, actually. I'm curious. Holy shit! Actually, no, hang on. The difference. We should be happy that he's made friends in this town so quickly. We came here to hide. More friends just means more trouble. You're being paranoid. You need to lay off that stuff. It's changing you. Oh, lay off. It's the one thing that helps me relax from your stupid shit. Oh, hey, whippersnapper. Didn't see you there. Your friends are downstairs, kiddo. Get out there and play. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, my God. Give me a sec. Sorry, I'm faffing. I forgot to start some photo stuff earlier. It's like the cinema photos. Oh, I love the cinema photos. They're great. Today's been great. But yeah, I just went up to my mother. And I didn't really ask her. I was, I was just like, I was going to ask you to take my photo like, with the poster. And she said, well, come on, I'll take your photo. Come on. So, what did I post this? Day? Hang on, let me try this. Oh, it's for the contest thing, never mind. Give me a sec. It's like a cat picture earlier. I'm making sure that that. I'm going on a break in a minute. I'm going to leave you with like the battle music when, you know.
when they go do that battle. <laughs> Very vague. Anyway, come on. I tried to make like the start of the game the like Steve from season three. Uh, I like the season two look because he looks more like a final girl, honestly, and because I couldn't really figure out season four, nor did I want to, kind of. Alright, be there. Stop carping before he starts all this. What are you kids doing? We stopped playing superheroes like five days ago. Yeah, get lost, juice bags. This isn't a trick, it's me, Frank. Fuck you, dude. I'm Craig. We don't have time for this. Stand aside. We have to get to Carbon. Well, you just have to get past us and our king.
Alright, time to defeat our past selves. Oh my god! <laughs> this is, this is so funny! And then to add to the confusion, everybody. Ashley. I'm gonna take a picture, I got. Just make friends who don't <laughs> Oh my god, that's funny. Oh, I wish I had better pictures, but you know what? Fuck it. Fuck it! Just... I don't care anymore, honestly. And I think I used to feel guilty, like, when I need to take breaks, but like, I didn't... Well, Sorry. <laughs> But like I didn't prioritize my my breaks enough before, and I'm glad I do now, like more often. She's trying to get in like better habits and shit. Pussy. <clears throat> what? Strongest warrior in my ass. Or the king. Or the king. All hail the king. I'll take you on. Me? I got your back, man. These primitives have no chance against our future tech. Hmm. Oh, what shit timing. Kill them with your makeup, butthole! That feels like I literally just do that and then you're done. <laughs> See? Nice. Uh oh, indeed, bitch. My batteries are bottoming out. We need to beat ourselves soon. Actually, I have an idea. Stay in here. Yeah. This will help you. Let's go. There we go. Getting better at this. This is a job for the king, cutting rogue. You're not going to last long fighting all of us yourself, Cass. So, I wouldn't be so foolish, stupid Craig. Wow. I don't know why I didn't consider just like restarting the game before. Are you like, serious? That's so fucking late. Ugh, guess I gotta take this asshole on. I'm not gonna do the DLC. The DLCs are too long, and after I fight Morgan Freeman, I, I might still okay, be up for I'll streaming, but definitely not okay, the okay. DLCs. I know how tired they can be tiring. I'm just saying. You see how ridiculously easy that is? Right, I've learned my lesson before. So, hopefully, this works. And if it doesn't, I don't know. Yes! Yes! It's about damn time. Ah, shit bags. Here I go. Die. None of us could reach, by the way. So. My turn. Nice. That was kind of fun. Oh, shit. You fought that with me. I'll avenge you. Guards, you're no match for us. Wow, past Kyle had such a cool costume. What happened? When they, those are things we think, but don't say. She's not wrong, though. I was a lot cooler before. I do kind of miss sick a trip, but it's doing no. I don't know if I'm ready to go back yet, honestly. Deserve 
that. Totally. Oh shit, ultimate. If we really fought ourselves in the past, shouldn't we like remember it? I remember fighting myself in the past. I mean like never mind. This dude is on fire! Nice. I fucking love some of their lines though. Excellently small, he says. How the f mm. this is my time. How the fucking no fuck are they still alive? I'm sorry, my king. I failed you. Oh, geez. Don't worry, I got this. We will fight by your side, my lead. Oh, hey. Ah. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. You kneel before the king, future new kid. Fuck. You not happening. How'd you fail end up here in the pet? The new kid farted really bad and ripped the hole in time and space. Wow, you couldn't come up with anything better than that. Uh. Oh, hey, just leave him alone. I'm sure everyone on your mission board is rooting for you, call girl. Aim for that one. Me for this. Huh? What a pathetic investment portfolio. <laughs> so they finally talked us into playing superheroes, huh? Yeah, and look where I got us. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Exactly. So our Shh, no talk. Oh my god, stop being rude, butters. Oh my god, look at us. <gasps> We're perfectly lined up. Actually, let me take another picture. I took the picture and I looked and there's just Bradley uh, spinning in the background, like mid spin kind of. We're gonna take down everyone. They can cast protection spells and shit. I'm no fucking fucking with them until every Marion. single one of them is dead. Here we go. Ah. Uh -oh. You're so melodramatic, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really more of a healer than a fighter, fellas. Though I can do both. I wish you couldn't do both now. Go, King, go! Go, butthole! Some duct tape on that wound. You'll be fine. Fuck's sake. This feels like a good time for a mobbing. Go ahead. I would brutalize, but I want to get rid of everyone else, so we can brutalize later. Hey, look, Hi there! Hello! Hi! Go, I like the username, it's just... <laughs> Sorry, it's... It's funny because I went to the movies today and I had popcorn, so I was just thinking funny coincidence. I don't. Kill them. Right, who still needs to die? You're. And you. Okay, there we go. That'll solve it. I'm really nailing it, aren't I? Oh, I'm up. Okay. Yes. There. It's time. I like it though. I think it's a good one. Today, you crossed paths with the wrong immortal fourth grader. That was some dark shit, man. Go 
Oh, damn it. Close. I should comment, but honestly, I can't even do it. Hmm. Go nuts, new kid. Thank you. Probably shouldn't have you dying on us. Oh, it's brittle, but it just it does the job, honestly. It's the most powerful ultimate move I've ever freaking used. Defeated. Yeah. <laughs> <Out of here. laughs> nice. Honestly, I do think season two Steve might have season three beat. Oh, this is all lava. We don't have time for this shit. Oh my god, how do you do this? Chose popcorn because it's better than crochet. Fair enough. Fair enough. Oh hi kids, I believe Eric is up in his room. Guys, I was just traveling back in time to find you. A cat's missing. There's a big reward. Wait, why are you guys already playing superheroes? We know what you're up to. Because we know, Here Cartman. You're but you're with the Freedom Pals. Not we anymore. Freedom Pals. We're well, from the technically, technically, yeah. I was, I was just coming back to stick a truth time to get you guys. We aren't playing anymore. We know everything. Show us your left hand. My left hand? For what Show you... us your fucking left hand. For what you? What was he going to say there? For what you? Hey. Just, I don't even Hello, know. Freedom Pals. Time travel. Ain't it a bitch? Connor, what the hell are you doing here? I had a plan to use the new kid as means to get what I always wanted. But it looks like Oh, popcorn lover, thank you for the me. follow. Come thank in, you. Knock it off. But that's okay, because I still know something you all don't. What's that? How to make someone fart super bad by hitting them in the solar plexus. Yeah, Connor, no! Well, shit, off we go again. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. Where are we now, Connor? We're in the time that a superhero was born. Recognize this place, new kid? A little child laying awake at night, unable to sleep. Why have you brought us here? Don't you see? This is the night, new kid. The fateful night your dad fucked your mom. Dun dun dun. He walks to the mirror. Don't do this to him. But don't you see, Coon? This is what he wanted all along. I love Thank making you. new kid Steve Harrington, but honestly, the whole parent so thing, like, room. not this part, don't go, but other bits kind of just. Curse you can. Go look. <laughs> Thank you. So like I was like listening to Kid Steve Harrington since I can, so then I can do the Final Girl DLC and finally Steve Harrington can be proclaimed as the Final Girl. I have technically done it already, but that wasn't like the full DLC, so we're doing it again. Yes, don't you see, new kid? I've given you an opportunity. Which will you do, new kid? Fight the bad guys again, or fight your younger self so that you never have to witness what's behind your parents' door? Bad guys. Hey man, look, we're just followers. What? You're the what? little kid <laughs> so right? like, we what? Well, we Thank thought you. that if you had <laughs> us, and maybe, you know, maybe we could have friends. Because we don't really have any followers. Couldn't Still, a shitty that? reason to break oh, into oh, my oh. house. Why? Our moment is finally here. It's what? happening. <laughs> We did it, everyone. But let's be honest. I'm so happy. Talking Stranger Things, I could honestly see Steve's kids just like breaking into his house whenever they need something. And whenever I say Steve's kids, I'm largely referring to the group that's like Dustin, Lucas, Max, Erica, whoever else is involved. Probably Robin. <laughs> honestly. <laughs> anyway. Oh, hey, kiddo. Everything I'm not right? setting for you your you entire thing because it's too? gross. I don't wanna. What we are gonna do is fix this. 
and eventually fight Morgan Freeman. <laughs> oh shit, I forgot to do the believe in yourself. I only really get into Stranger Things because my sister and I didn't know what to watch. Um, we found it on Netflix and she's like, should I just put this on? And I'm like, eh, sure. We just kind of get hooked on it because the characters. It's okay, but eh. It has its moments. Let's do this. This way. And off we walk. Come on. We skip that. Skip that. Skip that. Okay. Let me. Who do I usually drag into this fight again? Ready to go fast? Yeah, that's it. Okay. I'm trying to. Hmm. It'd probably be a really bad idea putting the big old siblings in the same fight, but at the same time, as much as I hate this one, Mintberry Crunch, I kind of want to see what would happen. Ugh. And also, she's a goth witch. Henrietta is the best one out of all of these. You're the worst. Breakfast Elementalist. Oh my god. Why? Let me show sure I'm hooked up and everything. Yes, yes, and yes, okay. Knock it off, Cal. Seriously, it's not fucking funny. Dude, I'm not doing it. <laughs> Bullshit. Mm -hmm. Mr. Matacoon, you're not When I get to call it. girls, she's like, out. she's always in the team after that. But usually I have human kite, call girl, and either Mysterion or fast pass. But we're switching it up and dragging the big old siblings into this. Honestly, I didn't know the DLCs existed. Like, I got the Seasons Pass because... Actually, we're attacking him, I don't care. <laughs> because I won't need the little Towley comment thing. And then I found out there was DLCs. I'm like, this is interesting. You're up now, butt lord. Who's it gonna be? Me or the king? I'll type both of you. Easy. <laughs> Nicely done, Freedom Pal. Bounces off me and sticks to King. <laughs> Kyle, this is super weird. It is super weird. How about you, Freedom Pal? Which one of us is the real villain? Are you really gonna make us do this, Kyle? I'm not doing it. Ugh. Ugh, same. Kyle's my favorite character, but I absolutely hate this part of the game for sorry, Kyle, but this is your fault. so many reasons. I think you meant to hit the king. You guys know you're only hurting the coon, right? Uh, yeah. Uh, God. God damn you guys. I don't think we care, just as long as it finishes it, honestly. Well, well, well. Good to see you again, Mitch from an alternate universe. Oh my God. Fucking damn it. They are just... Ah, oh, shit. We can't attack anyone from here. Damn it. Okay, let me try this. Why combine men and berry? That combo sucks. Thank you. The real Mitch Connor is going to show you how it's done. Mitch, no! Ha! You didn't even come close. Oh my god. Why can't they just fight each other? I mean, they're doing enough of that already. Nope. Okay, no. You drag call girl into it. That's where I gotta call it off. Give a sec. Give a sec. Give a sec. Butters, stop. Stop asking me that. I swear to God. It'll take more than that to take me out, Freedom Pals. That didn't count. Here. 
you think you can just come in here and make your own rules, imposter? You stop messing around, man? God, Menbury Crunch is a superhero. He doesn't even have, like, any kind of useful moves, I feel. I only really dragged him into this because, I don't know, for fun. It is weird, because I'm so used to seeing, like, him and Henrietta on, the, on like, the sidewalk. It is weird. Ah, mother- mm, Damn it, I, I fucked that up. To kill him for fun. <laughs> Mind warning me before you do that next time? War. <sighs> no, that <laughs> made. Hmm. <laughs> warn you before what? Before you do it, your fucking sale. Okay, at this point, we're just attacking whoever's closer. <laughs> I've heard that in some talk, but he's never actually said it when I play this. Time to die, posers. You want to burn so badly? Burn. I'm still burning as if anyone cares. I just feel more empty inside. That damage doesn't count. That'll decrease your movement, too. Ah, fuck. You're really determined to kill us, aren't you? We've lost the coon. Oh well. Oh well. <laughs> It'll take more than that, Freedom Paz. Oh, this is getting fucking retarded. I agree. The only way to end this is to defeat both of them. Uh oh, here we go. Oh. Wait, 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 wait. Haha. -ha. Are you a hemophiliac? Let's back out. Life is pain. Hey, try and hold it until Henrietta's turn. She can summon Satan, so. Just try and do that. Uh, no. Oh, fuck you! I should have seen that coming. I'm very, very, very surprised that she's still standing, honestly. But I'm grateful. You made them even lamer. Good. You ready for a flash mob? Because I am. Honing in on the signal. Clever girl. It's a Jurassic Park. In the longest time he's said that before but it was i was saying the police station and a stream that was forever ago that'll do it i love doing your satan summoning one like see this is how i don't believe that satan's on the woodland critter side because like you know that was awesome Clever girl. I always know that's like a Jurassic Park thing. I just oh my god. You gotta drop it, Kyle. You fucking drop it. Pat ass. Tell these guys you were just fucking with me. They're gonna just keep beating the shit out of both of us. Yeah, dude, Kyle, if you're just fucking with us, we have to know. You're just making things more confusing. If I was just fucking with you, then so was he. Now here we go. Maybe I'll admit I know, that was great. But only if Kyle admits to it first. I'm not saying anything until he does. You admit it first. Oh all right, my back. God. We'll both admit it at the same time, all right? On three. We'll both say I was just fucking with you. Bad? Fine. Okay, bad. One, <laughs> two, three. I was just fucking with you. Ha ha, gotcha. Oh, <laughs> you asshole. Okay, so now I don't know what team I want for Morgan Freeman Empire. stuff. Because I have Henrietta and her ultimate can heal all of us. I can only use Moses once, like when I fight with Freeman, but I have the Brutalist Ultimate, which takes a good, significant amount of health, so it is very tricky figuring out what we should do, honestly. 
I do solemnly swear. I do solemnly, solemnly swear. swear. Wait, wait, stop. Yeah. What's going on here? Just finish the ceremony. Everyone, listen. This is all just a plan to get more crime in our town so that the Coon and French franchise... <laughs> it's like the shocked and appalled face that that freaking hand has that just kills me. ...has been put into your drugs and alcohol to raise crime in the city so that the Coon would have more crime to fight. Everything was thought of by this asshole. Exposed. Mitch a fat raccoon. No, don't you get it? He did it all. Go ahead, new kid. Show them the selfie you took. Okay, hang on. Let me scroll through my entire list of selfies. Now upload it to me, and I'll put it on Connor's Instagram for everyone to see. On it. X to upload. What? Look, Mitch Connor's plan. Hey, they're right. You mean he was putting poison in our wine and cocaine? Mm -hmm. Why? Yeah, why? Yeah, why? I'll tell you, eh? Oh, here because we go. The new kid <laughs> isn't the only person who had a parent get fucked. My dad he got fucked when I was nine years old. What? Only two people on this stage know how that feels. Okay, so this always, like, he's like, only two people on this stage know how that feels. And, like, we're going to pretend that Connor's, like, an actual person here, right? If he's one of them and I'm one of them, the third one has to be Cartman, who's got very obvious parental issues with everything. So... Pretty sure the third one's Carmen. Just... Stop with that already! Shh, I want to hear this. My father will be avenged, even if it means everyone else has to die. <laughs> Mitch, Mitch, it's over, ma'am. What the My hell God. are you doing here? I've been here all along, son. It's not your fault, Mitch. It's my fault. What are you talking about? It was me, Mitch. I'm the one who fucked your dad. Whoa! <laughs> what? You fucked my dad, ma'am? Why? I did it for us, son. I wanted a future for you, all these years! Hunting for the person that fucked my dad, and it was my own mother! Mitch, try and stay calm. Fuck you, kid! You may be really cute, but even you can't fix this! <laughs> Did he look at you, ma'am? Huh? I remember the episode the where this <laughs> fucking thing started, and it started as Jennifer <laughs> Lopez. Please tell and then turned into this nonsense, and honestly, I fucking me. loved it. Welp. Well, thank God that guy isn't gonna be mayor. Come on, everybody. Let's go get clean drugs and alcohol from the next town over. Morgan Freeman is easy to fight with Cartman, Kenny, and a DLC character. Oh, God. I don't want to fight with Cartman, though. I spent the entire game not wanting to fight with Cartman until we do the DLC bit. Oh, my God. That'd be Jimmy doing his thing. Let me switch up. Okay. Wendy, I can't fucking. Oh, there they are. I feel like Wendy's good to have in the fight because, like, well, she can hit him from. I like Jimmy for just obvious reasons. Not Cartman than Craig. Nah. Wait, hang on. Where is it? 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 Is it in here or is it in the is it in the other one? Like no, that's the one. Superheroes report to Lake Tardikaka. Early check. Two brutalist moves. Two Nellerborn moves. I think we're fine. Seriously, get out here. Shit is going down. I don't know. We're gonna risk it. We're gonna risk it because I'm an idiot. Got some new stuff today. Get it while it's hot, so you can eat it cold later. Oh shit, I was there the entire time. Of course I when was. You... Let me see if I can craft any of these, because we're going to need them, because he's going to kill us. I love Maximum Revive Serums. 
All right, let's see. Yeah, mm -hmm. these as well. Need right, Morgan okay. Freeman. You know where I'll be. You're digging your eye. Wouldn't do that. Hey. All right, let's go. So we're not going to do DLC stuff bad, today. Okay. I'm going to put this in a save slot well, and open a new game in another slot. Obviously. All right. I did defeat him last time with this trio. It was rough, but we did actually manage to do it. Is this the end of Morgan Freeman? No, it is not. Yeah. I break. You do something? Yes, he did. Fuck him up, new kid. Uh, not bad, kid. I almost felt that. Hashtag my turn. You'll never browse in this town again. Feel the wrath of human ice. Ah. Nice. Stew that troll in his own juices. You wouldn't like Morgan Freeman when he's angry. Oh my god. Oh, Morgan Freeman just farted on us. Wendy, stop Morgan sounding excited. That is not a thing to be excited over. Uh, Let me be clear. A funny way of treating your mentors. I know. You've gotten stronger, new Ah, oh, fuck's sake. Already. It's fine. We got this. What if they just punch each other? What doesn't kill you makes you fast. Yeah, for you. I'm gonna kill out. You want to heal? I got to heal. Yeah, yeah. We're playing it safe. We're playing it safe. We're trying to play it safe. Well, fuck. That's what happens when you try to do that, unfortunately. Thank you. <laughs> oh, that was cute. Okay, we have an ultimate. Okay, 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 okay. What do we do? Healing in point three seconds. All better. Thanks. Okay, we can do this one against both of them. Which I feel like we should do. Alright, use an ultimate. And maybe... Ah. Use the ultimate and the brutalist attack. And maybe... Ah. Accomplish something with that. Ah, oh, motherfucker. Whatever happens next, just remember okay, that's on me. That's on me for not seeing that come. Not seeing that, so it's fine. See, I knew it was a good idea to wait and just do that. That's a lot more damage. Is that your blood? Oh my god, butthole! Anyway. <laughs> I think I got this. We'll be fine. How dare you hit a kid with Maybe. I mean, we're still alive. That's kind of for something, methinks. We might need that Moses quicker than I thought. New kid, you're all right. Oh, thank you. We're gonna fucking die, but it's fine. Time power. Right here's the thing. You're gonna stand there. And you are going to eat something. What the fuck is your health at? What would it be? 310? I don't want to give you one of those. Oh, there's a bag. That's better, actually. Good, 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 good. Yep, this calls for call girl. Brutal. Now the truth is out there. It is not wise to keep the wizard two around, I know, but still. Okay, that's better. 
God damn it. Yes, I did. Just tell me if you want me to call 911 for you, diabetes. Di you got this. What the fuck, Wendy? Sorry, but just really? Really? So did. I think we're gonna have to go invisible. The call girl heeds the call. You should just shave off your fingerprint and start over. I'll have you I'm really trying here. I think we're doing okay so far. Look, it's just difficult trying to keep everyone alive. <laughs> That's definitely it. You've summarized it perfectly. We've held them off for a bit. I'm hoping I can get forward and like go brutalist on him and take him down a bit because I know that's a strong one. See, exactly. your head butthole I'm good you've got me on the ropes new kid but I'm not out yet ah shit he's gonna he's gonna do the thing isn't he we're so fucking screwed when that happens time to shoot the lasers all right all right just fucking sh throw yourselves it's okay we're doing we're doing good we're doing great we're okay we'll make it No. Everyone try to keep up. Jeremy go invisible. I'm not really invisible, but my atoms are vibrating too fast for you to see. Listen to my heavenly voice and gaze upon my friends. Congratulations. You've just been framed. We have the bonus of having someone invisible, so one of us is not gonna die. So there you go. Fried beans do not agree with me. Ow, this isn't particularly on. behavior, superhero. Right, if we get another ultimate, I can kill him. I can kill him if I have another ultimate. Cure this again. I did not do it, did I? No. God damn it, that mmm! Did not do what it was meant to. God fucking damn it. God fucking damn it, give me a minute. That would be massively helpful, but I gotta lift myself up first. I can't find the things. Come on, Steve Harrington is a final girl. The final girl lives, so you gotta live, dumbass. I'm not risking him fucking doing that. Oh, shit. I mean, I'm totally fine, but still. Okay, give yourself a heal. Back in business. Listen oh, to my come the fuck on. Congratulations. You've just been freemen. Well, great. Oh shit. Super oh fuck. I'm about ready to well. some social media accounts. Okay, well, fuck. I I'm kind of scared. We are in a huge load of trouble. Okay, I think at this point... 
Fuck. That's really bad, actually. That's terribly bad. Okay. That's it. We gotta do, like, the ultimate heal. We're gonna revive everyone. And we're gonna Moses. And that should give us enough health to survive whatever next attack might happen. Okay, that's the plan. We can't do this without you. We just gotta Moses up, which we have not done for the entirety of this fight up to now, which is really good. So we totally got this in summary. There. There we go. Meanwhile, at the Hall of Super Best Friends. Let all debts be forgiven and all slaves free. Time to break a leg. All right, perfect. I'm gonna make him go invisible again because that's secret weapon shit. That's just in case it's a, it's a fail safe really. So. Listen to my heavenly voice and gaze upon my. Oh no 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 no. We'll take all the help we can get. Ha! Booyah! It worked. I should just punch him. I keep forgetting I have like a punch option. Listen to my <laughs> heavenly voice and gaze upon my record. Oh my god. Freemaning me doesn't work, so we just switches to someone else. Hers I'm not even surprised by. Alright, bye bye. This is the part where the bad guys regret their life choices. Yes! 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 And that is how it's done! That is how it's done! That was awesome. Holy hell. Okay, that was great. I need some more stuff. Okay. No, I could do that. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Always fun doing that. <laughs> Case for crafting. Nailed it. <laughs> Five Lord, I need your help. I know. We have to save her. Get on the DLC bus and come here now. I can't do it without you. Well, I'm doing that now. I'm not gonna. I'm not. I'm not gonna stop. Like streaming. I'm gonna just. Let me do the thing and then I will get back. Sleed the proper way. Thank you. Alright, let's give me a sec. Give me a sec. Give me a sec. Give me a sec. How do you do this? I'm trying to figure it out. I'm trying to figure it out if I can. Because I can't remember how I do it. Like, if I go into new game. We're gonna probably erase what we have. I don't wanna do DLC stuff today! I don't know now. I'm too, I'm too scared to do it, actually. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Unless. Wait, hang on. Isn't it when you do a new game, you only erase the previous data? Oh, hang on. Oh, then I was doing the entire thing right. Okay, it's fine. Right, I'm pretty sure, I'm definitely sure, actually. You only erase the other data if you choose to erase it, but you can save another slot. Because I think I've done that before, and now I regret not doing it. Ignore, 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 quit in the game again, go back. Okay, new game, just get into this nonsense. <laughs> Ignore me being a dumbass. It happens a lot. It's fine. Get into it.
Blah 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 what? intro. Ah oh, damn it, we can't skip the intro. <laughs> I forgot. Also, not, not a city. They keep Crash calling it a true. city. I'm Cats like, with the, like the main song, the first song of the movie calls it a quiet little mountain town. Don't call it a city. We were supposed to protect those who couldn't protect themselves. Get off my car, you little pecker! It's just so now embarrassing hearing them call it that when it's not. Yeah, political differences. At war. Political differences. <laughs> Why do I feel like he's the one who wrote that? Save our city. Time travel is my only hope now. Myths tell of ancient times. When a new king united a kingdom, torn apart by a powerful stick. Hi, hon. Shut up, man. There's no time to waste. I have to go back. Change the present if I can. And find this cat. And is doing so. Oh, damn it. Wait, I am. Let me see if I have a picture of this. It doesn't matter what it is. Okay, hang on. Give me a sec. Give me a sec. Give me a sec. I had the picture around here somewhere. I need to find the picture. I want to do another character. Like, I've dressed up my character as Steve for two games now i want to pick another stranger things character and i know what one i want it to be but i need a picture of her outfit if i can find the picture i did have of her which i can't so dang it hang on hang on hang on <laughs> find it find it find it find it i mean I think it's durable. It's close enough to durable, actually. Yeah, okay. I just go into it like this because it's really funny to go back and see your past self with your present self and see how different they are, honestly. So, yeah, this is fine. Because then you get your, your you get your access to costumes, you get to do the whole change thing, you make them look so different from each other. It's hard to believe they're actually like the same person. It's so funny. Good You don't want to know. This is the weirdest mini game they have for this game. And I've seen some weird shit. Alright, so let's see. If I click save, that there we go. That's what I forgot we can do, because I'm an absolute moron. There we go. Okay, so we're gonna aim to be Robin Buckley in this one. My first, one of my first fictional crushes, actually. So she came into Stranger Things about three years ago when season three released. Uh, I don't know why I'm relaying this information. I just felt like it. <laughs> Oh no, we need to go in set and do the whole toy box thing because since I have the seasons pass, I get access to all the outfits. Even the ones I don't even wear. So we gotta set for this thing on. The good news is we get some massively loaded artifacts. I've played a bit of danger deck, just enough to get the uh, the ninja contract. And that's it, because I absolutely hated every second of it. It was hard. I tried to pick good, tr good like, good allies to go in with, but still. 
<laughs> this fucking shark mating whistle. Oh, I remember that one episode. <laughs> Anyway. Well, that's all the stuff. <laughs> Okay. Oh, the fighting should be fun. Who else wants to take a nap? Because I do. You can go if you want. I don't mind, honestly. But I'm not tired. I was tired earlier and now I'm not. And I kind of want to stay up. But I seriously wouldn't mind if you wanted to go and sleep, honestly. Hi, Jason. Hi, Jason. Yes, thank you for all your support. Thank you. <laughs> that was weak as shit. Wow, when you said really hit him, he really hit him. Bye, Jason. Good seeing you. Oh, that's what you think. Okay, I got like a specific way I'm gonna fight these guys. It's gonna be awesome. Oh, hang on. Wait, there we go. This one first. How did I do this last time? You can't keep the moors down. So I'm pretty sure it's st and that can cover all three, right? Wait, wait, don't skip your turn. Okay, no, you told me not to skip my turn last time and I fucking nailed their asses because I didn't listen to you, okay? You have no chance against all of us. See? Don't skip your turn, really. It would have taken me longer if I hadn't. We're going through that door. You can't. Oh yeah, why not? Because everything in front of here is lava. Oh, dude, no way. All that is lava? Yep, everything from here to here is lava. You can't touch it. Of course. Shit! Come on, let's get inside. We can't. They're seeing everything in front of the door is lava. Oh, that's not fair. What do we do, the king? What do you do now? You die. Release the dragon! Well, shit. Okay, if you get a fire breath attack, our 
Dean gets his hammer of heavenly rain, you can't stop the kick. Car. Car. Yeah, they can, but the cars can. Stay out of the street, damn kids. Clear. Oh, it reminds me of one of the houses I was selling in a few years ago. So, okay, the way it was, was like, okay. Like I, was saying, you can't stop the king. He is all I can't fucking hit them though. The way it was, was that the road to actually get down to the houses and where they parked the cars, you got like kind of a hill. So like the road was on a little bit of a hill and like all the kids would play there with like their scooters and bikes and everything. It was like chaotic trying to get home and everyone would just scatter off the roads. It was funny. Oh, they really sing your prayers. Praises. Praises. Can't talk. Yeah, you heathens. Yeah. The king. Yeah. I thought he was with you guys. Now we got a distress signal to come help him here. <laughs> well, shit. The wizard is gone. My name is the king. I'm from the future. Oh, my God. Dude, we said we're not playing that anymore. Yeah, we're all split up. What's the point? This is the point. In my time, there is a massive crime wave and missing cats. I knew my only hope was to assemble the team. Hey, you can't switch games like this. Where's the stick of truth? Shut up, Kevin. This isn't about some dumb stick. Uh, we broke the secretary. Did he not keep up with the fucking lore? Oh, my God. That sounds too heavy for Coon and friends. Well, what do you want, Clyde? You want the fucking Freedom Pals to find the missing cat? Get the hundred dollar reward and make their superhero franchise more popular? Fuck the Freedom Pals, dude. That's right. Since when is Clyde on our side? You fucking banished him from space and time, you know, after he went evil. This makes no sense, Cartman. No wonder he switched games with all these fucking plot holes. No wonder. Oh my goodness. Oh, hello. The boys are down in their little basement playroom. Oh, I barely had to have my tongue today and it so kind of hurts. That's like the risk of getting hot chocolate. I always know the risk and I always burn my tongue. Oh, did you get locked out? I'm afraid little Eric put a lock on the door to keep me out. I'm sure he has the passcode written down here somewhere. This is just such a weird picture to, to have in your house. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Like at the end, of, like near the end of the Stick of Truth game, like, we defeat Clyde for the last time, Cartman banishes him from space and time and, like, kicks him off the castle. He lands in a heap in the ground, so I'm asking, how is he back here on, like, our side, is my question. That doesn't make sense to me, honestly. I hate this diary, I'm just gonna skim, skim through it as fast as possible. Got it. Really gives you some insight on Carmen's fucked up mind and his really, really weird obsession. It's a, I'm gonna be honest, I have yes, said this officer. before. Somebody appears to have put Cartman my door. has no, a weird not, obsession and maybe Joe Goldbergy it. crush on Kyle. If you've ever seen or heard about oh, like the Netflix yes, show you, you or even like the books it's based off of, like this is not to do with romance or shipping or fuck all. It's just like Cartman is obsessed with him. It is weird. It is creepy. I fucking hate it. I don't know what the point of that was, but let's just go. It is cool. A hundred dollar reward. Do you know what that could mean to our superhero franchise? That cat looks pretty old. Maybe it just died in the gutter somewhere. Human kite, do I have to remind you that as of right now, Freedom Pals have a hundred followers on Instagram? We have six. The five of us and Billy Turner, who's a ginger. 
This is the key to finally beating those fuckers. But where do we start looking? That cat could be anywhere. We need to split up. Mosquito, take to the air and check out all the city parks. You got it. Mosquito away. Human kite, see if the cat is stuck up a tree somewhere. You've got the storm drain, Super Craig. Woo! Super Craig. <laughs> Fast pass, I need you to use your superhuman speed to get to the mayor's office and tell her we're on the case. Don't worry, Coon. You can count on Fast Pass to get there. Nailed up. Excuse me. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. Hey, 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 hey! Do not touch that! That device can blow up the entire Milky Way galaxy! Jesus, fuck! The funny ah! thing is, you hit that hard enough and you do actually head. die. You had it like often enough, I mean. Good shower, it'll blow up the fucking galaxy! Stupid bitch! Then why is it here? You, you can't play. You aren't a superhero. You don't have a costume. You don't have any superpowers. Uh, Alright, look, you can watch us play superheroes as long as you don't get in the way. Make yourself useful. Go grab me the Stephanie device. It's over there. Well, that took long enough. The furnace device active. You really want to be a superhero, huh? Play with the big boys? <sighs> well, maybe. Maybe you can be useful. Have a seat at the table, douchebag. Let's yes, see. exactly. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Are these even in a human language? Those always make me laugh over here. I think it's still on here. If I can. Let me look at your franchise plan! I'm gonna pick out the funny parts right, so and I can eventually look at that. You have to have a superhero persona. Then you can fill out your character sheet on Coonstagram. Do you have a Coonstagram page? No. Oh boy, you're not even on Coonstagram, huh? Well, I guess I can create one for you. Fucking unbelievable. Let's see. So the first thing we need to fill out on your character sheet is your class. You know, what kind of superhero are you? I like choosing Netherborn first, because I like doing Netherborn. one of the Netherborn. moves there. Feeling dead inside, I see. Also, a skip tutorial, and that's kind of awesome. Okay, douchebag, but now, we need to find out what terrible thing in your past drives you. You see, douche, all superheroes have a compelling <laughs> backstory. It's from that backstory that their powers gain meaning. Let's take you back to when you were just a child. <laughs> you lay awake that night, like so many other nights. You couldn't sleep because you knew you weren't like the other kids. Yeah, you I don't have hair. hair. I don't have hair for like non disease related reasons. And that's when it happened. Sorry, noise. that's mean. You swore you could hear your mother calling for help. You left your room. Out in the hallway. You saw two intruders in front of your parents' door. <laughs> you had to stop you from turning your parents. It's you just the, the, the lack of hair in this fucking. Oh, it's funnier than I thought. And so you beat them. All seemed to be okay. But then you finally reached your parents' door. And what you saw when you opened that door changed your life forever and led you to fighting crime. You were too late. Because when you opened that door, you saw... You saw your dad fuck your mom. Wow. That's a pretty heavy backstory. You fight crime because you never forgot the night you weren't in time. And you saw your own father, the man you trusted, fuck your mom. It's like a ripple in time you can't ever change, isn't it? Mm. All right. Now that you're a superhero, <laughs> I have a mission for you. I need you to go out into town Just and bald try to get in as that head is smooth. You can on <laughs> it's the only way our franchise will survive. Was it bad? Well, uh, can I look at that? <gasps> yes. Okay. So let's see. Let's see. Let's see. And the first one, Human Kite has two movies. One of them involving Cartman's and uh, Super Craig. I'm not saying Cartman's super name. Cause I know that's bad, so forget it. <laughs> we had an animated series for Tool Shed. Uh, okay. Rise of Captain Diabetes in Phase 2. Uh, young Cartman meets young Professor Chris. I'd be interested in that. Lil Super Craig sounds funny, honestly. Phase three, Super Craig three, the Earth explodes, and then followed by Fast Pass two, the Earth is okay again. 
Uh, but then you've got Professor Chaos live at Coachella. <laughs> you could use that head as a mirror. It's the Coachella one of like Professor Chaos that always gets because it's so stupid. All right, take that off. Hair. All right, I'm gonna pull up my reference picture. And I'm gonna pick out a hair. It's a very, very complicated process. Right. That's fucking perfect, actually. Hair color, hair color, hair color. It's tricky to tell, like. Actually, yeah, that's the hair color we like. Uh huh. That's perfect for her. So you got cloves. Okay, let's be honest. She would totally wear this. Right, what color, what color, what color, what color? No. A bit lighter. It's like a smidge. I mean, like... Yeah, that's the one. Give me a sec. Give me a sec, give me a sec. Where's the one underneath? It's kind of like that. Okay. This is her season four look. What I'm looking at here. But I can add smoky eyes back. Since that does look like something she would do. The baldness is funny with the face paint. <laughs> it looks close enough to her, honestly. I'm not fussed. Technically, she's meant to have a suit and tie. I don't have anything like that. And I don't think we get anything like that. So... I mean, if you're working with what you got, this is what you get. So. I don't, don't worry about it. Honestly, don't worry about it. I'm doing this for fun. I'm doing this for fun. I mean, like, I can give you the complete rundown of Stranger Things if you want. I'll give you, like, as much info as I can about it if you want. Like, season to season as much as I know. Which is a lot. But anyway. You want me to tell you? I'll tell you what I know. Some other bits are complicated, but I can just give you basic oh, rundown. Yes, I've heard of those. So, a lot of stuff in it is connected to Dungeons and Dragons, because that's where the show starts. Oh, I'll see you, on the internet. you have these four boys. Mike, Lucas, Dustin, and Will. And they're in, like... Mike's house in the basement. They're playing D and D. So, mm -hmm. so in D and D, uh, okay, in D and D, Will, Dustin, and Lucas get attacked by the Demogorgon, right? So, Will <laughs> rolls to attack, but unfortunately, the dice gets hey, lost, so they You're don't the know deal, if the Demogorgon got hero. him or not. When Will's leaving, it tells Mike, oh yeah, the derm the Demogorgon uh, got me. Sure, kid, let's do it. On his way home, on his bike, something tries to get Will. Uh, he makes it hey, home, nice. makes it inside the house, and something's coming at him from the distance. He doesn't know what, but he knows he's in danger. And when that thing starts to get inside the house, he runs out to the garage. He grabs a shotgun and he just points it at the door but unfortunately whatever it is makes it inside the garage and like above him and then he's just gone hence where the first episode is titled like the disappearance okay, of will byers right so the next day will's missing his mother is worried sick right we don't know where will is we don't find out for like a few episodes Right, a few. Will's got an older brother, Jonathan, and his mother, Joyce. They're basically the only family he's got. So, Joyce goes over to the police. She talks to Hopper, like, basically the, sh well, I guess we yeah, have the chief. <laughs> Joyce is one of the best characters because she she's just good at, like, just Your cluing things out. Good. But anyway. Keep up the good work. I'm still having trouble reaching some of the Kuhn friends. You might want to see what's going on. In the meantime, there's a girl with a shaved head who is who's escaped out of Hawkins' lab. 
You don't know anything about her yet. But she is more connected to Will than anyone realizes. So Will's friends realize he's missing and they think something's going on. Like they think something dark is going on. They don't know what, but they know it's not good. Okay, I guess you're popular enough to selfie with. So when they go looking for Will, they find this girl. <laughs> And for whatever reason, Mike decides to take her back to his house. Now, I guess. Uh, he finds a number on her wrist. Type, just 11. She's connected to a whole thing. It's well, weird. <gasps> the whole rundown of it is... The whole point of the show... I'm just going to give you like the full extent of what I know. There's a shadow realm underneath Hawkins where they live they call it the upside down that is where Will was taken is her name Eleven? yes it is Eleven L also Jane like those are the names that I know she goes by so so underneath Hawkins is the shadow realm the upside down and that's where Will was taken by the Demogorgon who would do such a thing it's just so mean the Demogorgon also manages ah, to get other people. Will survives in the Upside Down for a week before he's rescued. He nearly dies, but he doesn't die. Thank fucking God. So. I don't know how much you want to know. Like, I know a lot. Like, just... Okay. It's revealed in season one. The Demogorg and the flower looking thing. Yeah, that's it. That's definitely it. The Demogorgon was released into the overworld because Elle accidentally opened a gate to the upside down. So the Demogorgon is able to get into the overworld. And that's how it managed to get Will and everyone else. Even after Will's saved, he's... He's now got a bigger problem. They have a bigger problem. Because then you've got the Mind Flare. This is like a new thing. A huge spider looking thing. And it's not in the overworld. Not yet. But it is possessing Will. They do manage to get it out of him. But that means he now knows whenever the Mind Flare is near. And it's still alive. It was just in the Upside Down. So season three is when gets sorry oh, sorry I hit rambling. Robin was introduced in season three, knew nothing about the supernatural stuff. She got dragged into it anyway because of well Russian secrets plot and stuff. Sorry, I love rambling about Stranger Things, but usually it's about how much they suck at not killing off certain characters. Anyway, it's fine. Sorry. It's because season four. Season four came out fairly recently. And that's been a fucking roller coaster. It's been great. It's been great. It's been sad. But it's mostly been funny. <laughs> Who the hell are you? I do watch other Billy? shows. <laughs> It's because Stranger Things is like Sorry, just Jane, this is massive thing. Ago, there There's just the a lot to say about it. There's a lot of interesting so stuff. Like just, everything. just how everything's kind room. of connected with each other. But that's it. Lot of lot of D and D ref reference stuff in it. It's more season one, I think. Just that's what I think anyway. Anyway, it's either shows I watch. Um, obviously, Stranger Things and South Park. Uh, I'm mostly like animation though. So you've got, you've got Big Mouth and Human Resources are some of my favorites. Rick and Morty as well. I love Rick and Morty. I've been rewatching season five and. I don't know. Oh, sorry.
human kite from another universe is behind this door. I can't fight him for obvious reasons, you know. Alternative universe paradox shit. So you are going to have to take him out. You've got to really kick his ass, dude, <laughs> so that he wants to return back to his universe on the East Coast. You ready? All right, go get him. Oh, hey, Kyle. I'm big. Who's your friend? Did he come to play with us? All right, me from another universe. It is time for you to go back to your universe. What do you mean, Kyle? We're a team, remember? I'm not from another universe. We're like best super pals. <laughs> As you can see, he is the one running around giving the human kite a bad name. He was sent here to destroy me and weaken my power. No, no, I came to spend two weeks with my cousin and wanted to play superheroes. And then he said, okay, oh what superhero God. do you want to be? And I said, I want to be a human kite. Oh, I know, me kite. too. I'm human kite. A and friend of mine calls him Ford Eyes. So I went to Aunt Sheena it's and stuck. I said, I want to be human kite together. And she told him he had to do what I said because I was the guest. Remember? I'm sorry, me from another universe. But it is time for you to learn so like if my friend's here and she sees him she'll usually she'll ego. usually just oh, call him four eyes and right. probably talking if about really beating him up play, then this is how you do it well all right anything to make me and my cousin more like <laughs> god he absolutely <laughs> sucks though i love being able to fight him i haven't done a whole lot of sparring is this a no contact thing Contact, He's oh, so whiny. I mean, doesn't he whine? Him, He's just got this whiny tone. It's just Kyle, fucking annoying. Yeah, Fuck no. Annoying alternative <laughs> skinny <laughs> carpet. Oh, oh, no way. That's fucking great. I love that. I'm gonna start calling him that. I mean, now that I think about it, he does kind of whine in a very similar way that Cartman does. Okay, I think my inner ear fluids have stabilized now. Uh, that last hit didn't count, right? I'm undoing that damage, okay, Oh my Kyle? god, she's... she totally gets that off Cartman. Cartman pulled that exact same shit at the end. Hold on, I need a timeout so I can use my inhaler. I like it. You know my asthma flares up when I exert myself. God, he's so annoying. I had a shield, some kind of shield, like a like the Safer Tura, which also has a great sentimental value. Dude, human kite is an alien. There's no Jewish stuff involved, and you can't just make up powers in the middle of a battle. I'm not making it up. It's totally canon in my alternate universe. <laughs> Same. Hey, Monson, thank you for the read. Thank you so much. I hope you had a good stream. I hope you enjoyed yourself. Thank you. Wait, I thought I should get oh, this turn instead of the new kid because Sorry. he didn't wait when I said timeout earlier. So I think it should be Oh, my God, turn. right in the middle of the complaining. <laughs> oh, it's just about this guy, though. Hard, right? I don't want to cause any good, babies. good. Oh, this is gonna right, be a... here we go, my super ultimate power. Get ready. Are you ready? Oh, Jesus. Okay, Raph Kite from an alternate universe. <laughs> oh, yeah, because when has this move ever gone wrong? Yeah. Next one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank God that's over. Oh, he's insufferable. Oh, and oh, sufferable. You had enough, alternate me? Yeah, the superhero stuff really hurts. I better go back to my university. Oh, you're leaving? Dude, that sucks. Oh, I'm you're leaving? Oh, well. Now, I need some camphor phonique for my ear because I got a scrape on it by being farted on. Dude, I don't know how to thank you. From now on, call on me whenever you need help. Give me a sec. Give me a sec. Give me a sec. <laughs> Hello there. Hello. Sorry, I was doing something else. Sorry, I just. Yeah, just two heroes hanging out. <laughs> okay. Sweet. All right, let's go. Oh, hang on. I forgot to steal from you. Te technically.
And away we go. Honestly, I wasn't sure at first this looks a lot like who I was planning for it to look like. I'm proud of that. Who would do such a thing? It's just so mean. I think I want to grow my hair out like that because my hair is like short. My hair is shorter than that. But I've been thinking more and more about making growing it longer to like that level of hair. Level of hair. Why did I say level of hair? <laughs> Sorry. Anyway, moving on. Look out, my lord. Those are sixth graders. They're the most vile, evil beings known to superheroes. Yeah, and then you they talk about that. Everyone knows Keeper's mom has the nicest boobs. Dude, shut up about my mom's boobs, bro. Why oh, but sure, totally boobs? dangerous. You guys want to go to the movies? There might be some boobs in Wonder Woman. Movies are dumb. Sixth graders are so boobs. weird. Stupid, they're gross bro. and yeah, they're just weird. Squirrel. Dude, we beat up a squirrel yesterday, bro. You guys want to check out more of my sweet dance moves? <laughs> Who said you have sweet dance moves? Your mom said it right before she let me touch your boobs. <laughs> check this out. When I finish kicking your Oh, I hate the sex room, but that is always the funniest thing I've ever heard. Kite's got your back. From the sky, swoops justice. From the sky, swoops justice. Forthy scum, you guys are kind of scrappy. Ew, so gross. So gross. Feel the kite clear for takeoff. Oh shit, I can't get in front of him. Please don't die, new kid. I'm gonna die. I'm fine. I'm too strong to die. Robin Buckley did not die in season 4, which I was terrified of, so it's fine. Okay, now we can get him. Yes. The tables are turning. Shut up, I can't say no to kicking some forthy ass. Really, the only insults you have is like wuss and forfy, like very original. Oh my god! Wow, you really beat him. You saved me. Da, 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 da. Killing it out here. Wow, nice work, new kid. You took down a sixth grader. Keep it up. You really want a selfie with me? Of course. There we go. Watching you defeat that sixth grader was so cool. Maybe I can become as strong as you one day. Soon you will be approaching Super Craig's Fortress of Solitude. Super Craig hasn't checked in. I hope nothing's bad. And knock. Greetings, citizen. It is I, Super Craig. Super Craig. I'm sorry, but I cannot assist anyone with their problems right now. Super Craig can't find his guinea pig. Go to that is such a crisis. I find Stripe. He's not sorry. just a normal guinea pig. He belongs to me and my ex-boyfriend. That's right. Super Craig is gay. I'll bet Stripe is down in the basement again. We should start in the basement. That's the last place I saw. Come on. I'm thinking maybe he smelled the dog food downstairs. I know, he's the best. Definitely one of my favorites. I'll stand by the stairs and keep him from escaping. You do the rest, butthole. Be careful. This is probably the most challenging mission you've ever been given. So, some of my favorite episodes have been... Oh, sweet. Those okay. Be handy. You're welcome. I Look, call them the, uh, the pan flute epidemic high. episodes. Which... Craig shows any more emotion, he might get a best actor award. <laughs> okay. So I used to, I used to just say, like pandemic and pandemic too. But since we've had the uh, the pandemic special, I now refer to them as the pan flu epidemic episodes. I love them, just purely because of Craig in it. He's just totally fucking done, and it's just how 
Just the way he just out of everything. Okay, and now there's lasers shooting out of my eyes. Just shit for casual. Just... He was so done. <laughs> I yes, love that. Yes, brilliant rescue, but it wasn't just me. We have butt lorded and sickening asshole today. You did it, Doobie. If you ever need help, you can count on Super Craig. Awesome. I'm gonna rob your house real quick before I go. There, no, 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 no. Go back. Go back. Okay, no try. Ah, uh, yes. There you go. Want a selfie with the Craig of Steel. The Craig. Okay. There it is. <laughs> The chosen one. Okay, later, butt stuff. Oh my god, no. Stop! Mmm. He's so weird with me, honestly. I don't like it. It's like when you summon backstory you and he says the weird the weird thing and I'm like, why? Anyway. Been slaying ever since the few Margaret Freeman's <laughs> Thank you. Oh, Margaret Freeman's tough. But I'm tougher, clearly, so. <laughs> I hate what that is referring to, because I had to actually go and look it up. And then I'm like, oh, that episode. New kid. Well. <laughs> It was a funny episode, I'll give them that. It was just also extremely not weird. Bad, kid, not bad. Way to go out and get some followers on Instagram. I think you're ready for the next level. Head back to the coon layer. Coon out. Okay, but first We're gonna go visit my favorite group. I wish we had the golf kids again. I'd love to see them. Like, they appeared briefly, briefly, at the end of the vaccination special. They were in one of the, one of the future episodes. I think the one where the future was shit and Cartman was happy. Oh shit, I forgot the book. <laughs> we did see their future self. We saw some of their future selves. I can't remember which ones. I think they appeared in the Pajama Day episode after that. But like, I want another episode with these guys, because... I mean, this game was released after Goth Kid's Free, so Furkle's back. He's been forgiven and accepted into the grip again after he betrayed them all. I'm just saying what I remember from Goth Kid's Free, because I hated most of it. Wow, that chest looks super goth. Open it, new kid. Really? That's fucking it? That was anticlimactic. It would technically be better, but then again. Then again, now we'll just keep it as it is. Alright, thanks for stopping by. Thanks for hanging out. Thanks for following everything. Just thank you so much. Very appreciated. Bye. That sucked. Yeah. If a selfie is what conformists like you need to feel okay in their skin, Oh, today's one, great. Gotta go see minions and then just <gasps> hang out and talk to very cool people in my chat. <laughs> I hope you captured my cynical side at least. Always. This is so embarrassing. I love them. I'm like, oh, this is so embarrassing. This is gonna be the only selfie I take with you. But they're all smiles, which I very much appreciate. That's very goth. It is. Might as well selfie with you. <laughs> I have nothing to lose in this. Oh, and I love life. how that was so bright character design. <gasps> I love how this is crazy. Like, I eat the cigarettes and I go to take freckles. You helped us out, so yeah, we can take one of your selfies. Southies. Uh, yeah. At least they fake a smile enough for me to do it. I appreciate it. If I had to pick a favorite, life probably. A of disappointments. Probably Henrietta. That's just me. Like, I specifically, like, for Christmas last year, I was, I was like to my mother, the only thing I want is this South Park blanket, you know, the Henrietta one. 
if you please, which I did get by the way, it's comfy as hell. Stop. Luke, hit, stop. You see all those little I love the design on it mostly, lava. just the whole, lava, you well you know, Don't summoner of it. Satan thing she's Wait, got going on. Who would put lava there? Yeah. And Place lava throughout the town. I can't make it too easy for you. What good is the world without a little chaos? Dun dun dun. <laughs> okay, turn it off now. We'll deal with chaos when the time is right. For now, we have to keep our eye on the prize. Coon, action. Our eye on the prize, everybody. Let's go. Now watch this, bro. Oh, for fuck's sake. No. This one I learned from Usher, bitches. You are so weird. You tampons can't even step to this shit. Oh my god, so weird. Toddle along, toddle, toddle, toddle. So I'm thinking we just make her like a, you know, cisgender woman. Oh god, we need to go to Sissy's bathroom. <laughs> Which I'm gonna fucking despise. I'm insulted. No, I'm not really. I'm just kidding. I loved that episode. And I really need to rewatch a lot of Sci Fark. God, you know what I watched before stream? The first Minions movie oh, after going to the know. cinema and watching the second one. Being a Both of them were amazing, by the way, okay. but like... Totally suck, but I can't help but too bad. good, you know? Too yeah, good. I wish we Come had more way. movies like that, just in that franchise. Harder. You see, most superheroes augment their abilities with specialized equipment. You see this? It's a strength artifact. You'll find things like these all over town. The trick is to equip them into your artifact slots. Go on. Give it a shot. Every uh, artifact has a specific place it can be slotted on your body. Equip this one to boost your strength stats. It's so funny making this design Robin because she is... She may have lived, but she's not really like this type of... Might be a little uncomfortable at first. Your DNA is it's easier to make it Steve because like he gives off huge Final Girl vibes and he's been a fierce defender of the kids ever since like season Great 2. Power. I think you're ready to take on those sixth graders now. Go give them hell. Oh my lord. This little figurine right here of Cartman, I would get, and I recently, not recently, a few weeks ago, found out that such a figurine does exist. The thing is, I could only find figurines like the superheroes for like Cartman, Mysterion, and freaking Mintberry Crunch. So I was like, well, why isn't there figurines for all of them? There is, I just wasn't looking in the right places. Did I get any of them? No. I wish I did. Oh hey new kid, you found your first fast travel station. Look for more. They'll make your life way easier. Thank you. Oh, this is gonna be one this is gonna be wandering and just like getting all the fast travel bits. Here kitty, here kitty, kitty, kitty. Just throw a rock at it. No, I get to throw a rock at it. If you get to throw a rock, I get to throw a firework. Alright, Forthy, time to teach you a lesson. Time to teach you a lesson? Don't fucking throw a rock at a cat. Are we really going to take on the sixth graders? No mercy, guys! Yeah, you sure heard him. No mercy. You want to this ass kicking. More ass for me. Wow, you should okay, really you rethink your words before they come out of your mouth, you know that? Just saying. Where do I stand? I never know where to stand. If I stand here, or if I stand here. Like, what would make it easier for you, Craig? Champ, oh my god, shut up. If nothing else beating on you guys is really therapeutic for me. You gonna cry now, Porthy? Oh, I'm up? Okay. Galvanizing and Gus, he says. Hey, fuck you. I'm Super Craig. Stupid Craig? I said fuck you. <laughs> wow. make you kill nice timing. Nice timing. Yeah, I saw that coming. Okay, who's the next target of my unbridled rage? Fill her up. None of us. Man, we kicked some six right ass. Yeah, we did. Mm -mm -mm -mm. 
fucking nailed it. D -d 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 -d. Okay, that was pretty badass. That was. We make a good team. See you, man. All right, that was sweet. Wait till it gets on the internet about how the coon and friends beat up four sixth graders. This is great for our franchise. Kind of sucks for you though, new kid, because now the sixth graders are gonna be coming after you. You probably should have done that. That was pretty stupid. Okay, now go and get our franchise more followers. Totally nailing it. Okay, let's go. Whoa, whoa, wait a minute. You didn't fill out your kryptonite. Oh so, what, God. you're invincible? There's no way. That's against the rules. You have to have a weakness. Oh, says you. Go find Mosquito. He can help you out. I'll put the rest of the character sheet stuff on your map. Now get out there and do God, some superhero missions. God, such a hypocrite. That's the only way to fill out your character sheet. Okay, we need to do the whole... the talk thing. Which I do plan to do. We're just gonna... Probably just end up just doing the basics of, you know, just sorting all this shit out. Because, like, once I end this, I'm not coming back to this till probably next week. Because, you know, tomorrow's Minecraft. Probably not going to stream Friday. I'll be busy Friday anyway, so. Hey, you know, I'll be back Monday playing Minecraft, then Tuesday I'll be this again. Fun stuff. I do have DLC stuff to do, like on my other save. You dare disrupt the flow of chaos? <laughs> You'll never get in here, super fool. Says you. We should probably go see Morgan Freeman so we can tell us about the crafting shit I already know how to do. Welcome to Freeman's Tacos. If there's anything I can interest you in, well, you just let me know. It's just, like, it's just getting it over with. Freeman's Tacos is completely... You can combine food items into whatever you like. I'm not setting for crap. I've heard like a million Let's times if I can staple. help it. The burrito. A warm tortilla wrapped around, well, any old something. Oh my god. Here, I'll give you what you need to get started. This here is... Now to just... Now that you've got your first taste of crafting, let's dig in. You can combine food items into whatever you like. Go ahead. See what he sounds as bored as I feel when he says that lunch. first part. Congratulations, new kid. With an enchilada and a burrito, you've crafted an enchirito. That's the first time anyone's ever done that. Oh god, my mom wants to and give me a freaking have a few more recipes. You know what they test. Save your stupid ass. Nothing left to do now but document. And I think we both forgot system. about it. I had a rough weekend. I had like I had a sore throat, headaches on and off. I was crying a lot. I put okay, it down to that. Never do that again. So it was just that, and I was fine. But yeah, she was like, "Still, maybe we'll just give you a test," and then we just all forgot about and it. Just one more thing. They say that some farts are so powerful they can actually bend the fabric of time. You be careful out there. Anyway. Yeah, I shouldn't worry about this stuff yet. We never really used the whole, you know, antidotes and revive serums until we go fight Morgan Freeman or some shit. I don't know why I'm worrying now. Will we save the cats? Well, probably, honestly. There he is. You took a selfie with Ike. Let's do a better one. Oh, I just love doing this. <gasps> Yay, now we're real friends. Sorry. Kitty, kitty, kitty. Here, shitty, shitty, shitty. 
Yeah, that's what I thought. Keep walking, pussy. Need to get somewhere for fit, 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 fit quickly. Better run. Okay, you use it. See you, new kid. Call on me whenever you want to get somewhere. Fit. Call on me whenever you want to get somewhere. Fit, fit, fit. Call on me whenever you want to get somewhere. Fit, 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 fit. God, so people were like theorizing this shit out of like the ending of Stranger Things season four, right? The only reason I bring this up is I'm gonna offer my two cents on this. Newest villain, Vecna, will like break your bones, tear out your soul, he'll kill you, basically, right? Oh for fuck's sake. Let's make a deal. So how do you know he's gonna kill you? Because you'll start hearing a clock and your nose will Your nose will most likely bleed, right? So I know as one of his victims did have a nosebleed before a he started like heating the clock and eventually died. And people seem to think one of the main characters had a nosebleed at the very, very, very end scene of the season. And I'm like, if he did, that's very, very, very interesting. He's a character who everyone's wanting to have like some kind of villain arc for some time. Like Oh my god! You don't look happy with your current cell plan, kid. Oh my god! I got the end of it at least. I just, I just, I just really wanted to come to just go and like hear a little bit of Kanye, <laughs> South Park Kanye, because he's really funny. Some songs are so weird, I can't even. No, I think I'll just go get the fast travel bits and then go. We are gonna need to do the raisin thing first. Here, pussy pussy. That's what I thought. And we'll get them eventually. God, it's turning to things for volume one is so much easier to watch than volume two. It's just like it's mostly the finale of volume two because two and a half hours, great developments in some areas. Like we finally have a couple that we've wanted for years, right? And we never thought we were going to get it when it looked like one of them had been killed off. But no, he hadn't been killed off. People didn't like that, and I do agree, they need to kill off main characters, just, can we not start with that one? I have a few faves where I'd like to see live until the end. I would love for a certain one to get killed off, though. They did talk about, like, the possibility of more deaths in the table. But the fact that they brought up the one that I want them to kill off, I found that a bit interesting. They're like, yeah, if we killed this one, it would be super depressing. I'm like, it would be depressing, but we'd be fucking happy because, you know, we've been hating on him since season three. He's a lot better in season one and two, is all I'll say. Huh. 
Hello again. Somebody call for a fast pass? Good, good going, new kid. Uh. <laughs> 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 oh well. Oh, I don't know, it's Robin, so... <laughs> that was so fucking bad, but I'm just saying. Sorry, anyway. God, I really hope Robin gets a girlfriend in the last season. Here, I don't like that now there's more death in the table. Like, we were convinced all our favorites were gonna die Over in here, season huh? four. You know what? Right they kill off like the usual side character they make as love sure before they take out in a heartbreaking <laughs> way. It's only like yeah, so ramped up it more the sky, and, and more guys. as the seasons well, go on. And Eddie's death yeah, well, was like the fucking the saddest since he had like that improvised wings, last sure, line. Did not even know it was improvised under. until like I fucking heard about it? And then cried. What superhero are you? Super space. Oh my god, the mission! My fellow superheroes! I've completely forgotten! Back away, Temptresses! Mosquito knows what you were trying to do! Oh, wait, holy fuck, uh, yes. what are you talking about, kid? The Raisins girls are Mosquito's kryptonite! You gotta get me out of here! Uh, well, okay then, here's your bill! <laughs> I think not! You tried to charm me, I will not pay this bill! You have to leave a tip, asswipe! They aren't going to let us go without a fight, kid! Let's do this! <laughs> Why did Eddie die before getting Steve's heart off? Oh. oh, who knows? That's a great question. Cause Eddie didn't want to run anymore. Like it was a whole, it was a whole thing. Eddie was used. He, well, he was the diversion to get the bad guys away from what Steve and two others were trying to do. And Eddie had the opportunity to run to get away from the danger and you know what he didn't take it this time and I'm kind of mad at him because that was a stupid fucking thing to do the mosquito was coming with us no chance see Mr. Mosquito we told you everyone else in here was a loser here's some losers now oh my I god I can't leave now I got a picture of lemonade on the way they're gonna call me a loser when their hair looks like that welcome to the team you're gonna need a total makeover maximum sense in a mosquito that'll snap it out of it bitch I had I a total so makeover when me. I gave myself hair Oh my god. Good. Ah, 
spread the itch. Satisfying. This is the part where the bad guys regret their life choices. God, and everyone thinks Eddie's gonna come back come when, on, like, he looked fucked up beyond repair. That's the best way I can put it. Oh, those are my like, and you must have saved me his legs time. were just I'm gone, eaten away but by hero, the swarm that hero? attacked him. Dude, and people use the excuse that the bats again. can't kill. I'm like, no. Any no, they said the, the bats ups? aren't I mean, venomous. Okay, something. that's how... Steve isn't like Look, infected okay. by team, disease or shit. You can tell me. Because they don't carry disease. Alright, alright, let me see your character sheet. Then again, are we gonna take the word from the two guys who fucked up the season finale? Who knows? Take your time, it's a profound decision. And when you live with for a lifetime, Oh my nose feels weird, sorry. Tastes like crab and look like people. <laughs> to overthrow mankind, those guys. Yeah, those guys. <laughs> Oh, fair enough, because he's so fucking annoying. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna go do the skill thing now. I would do the church thing, but you know what? Everyone thinks you're a boy anyway, what does it matter what you do? I don't know if people head kind of Robin is like a transgender girl. Robin and Stranger Things. I don't know. I don't know. I would make her one, but I don't want to. Oh, we threw that again. The whole reasons on a rampage thing. Somebody call for a fast pass. You better run fast. <laughs> You're the new kid, right? Oh, great. Thanks mm -hmm. for coming. Have a seat. As your counselor, you can talk to me about anything, okay? Mm -hmm. I understand you want to talk about sex. <laughs> okay, see, I'm highly trained in a... Oh, it looks so much issue. like her. Okay, you don't have to be afraid. Okay, new kid. Awesome. It's, it's really simple. When, uh, when you want to talk about your sex, you simply... You can start by simply saying, you know, I'm, I'm a boy, or a girl, or other. <laughs> oh, I forgot this happened. Can you just hang on a minute? Yeah, you well, your impression was wrong. Just take a second. Uh, hello, this is Mr. Mackey, the school counselor. Yes, hi. Right. And, uh, I have your child here in my office, and well... Uh, your child has just let me know that um, uh, she she's actually a girl. <laughs> oh, you knew that. <laughs> okay. Just the, oh, you knew that. Well, no, no, of course it's it's fine. It's just uh, I, I believe everyone was under the impression that um that, that it was a, he was a boy. I mean, she was a boy. Okay, so the whole king and stick of truth thing was actually was actually a girl the entire time. <laughs> Yeah, no, that's that's great. That's great to know. Uh, I think I can really maybe be of help from here on out. Uh, thank you very much. Okay, bye bye now. Okay. Okay. Well, this is a shocker, new kid. Uh huh. Perhaps we should clarify exactly what you mean by by a girl. Ah, uh, boy. Now, someone okay. like classmate, baby. Well, she's what we would call a cisgendered girl. Okay, meaning she was born a girl. But there's also people in this world who identify as something different from what they were born with. Okay, and, and, and we call those people transgendered. 
Uh huh. So, uh, do you identify as being cisgendered or transgendered? It's like the no, sorry. It's the do you identify as being cisgendered or transgendered? Just reminds me of Cartman and that freaking bathroom episode because it's as funny as that was. It's just making me think about that. Okay, well, great. I mean, I mean, it would also be fun if you weren't cis, but he he tries. He's a little confused, but he's got the spirit. That's my girl. Just be careful, okay? Because there's there's a lot of people out there who don't accept you for what you are, and then you're gonna have to deal with them, okay? So, uh, but come see me anytime. Christmas break seems so far away. Oh my god. Hmm. Okay. If it ain't a cisgender girl. <laughs> I forgot these fucking morons say shit like that. This to our town. Oh my god, please, please, please can one of you say the line, whichever one of you says the line and tells these assholes that they're cisgender, now is the fucking time to say it, okay? One of these guys definitely says it. It's either Kite or Craig. I don't know, but one of them says it, and it'd be really funny if they said it. I'm gonna punch you straight, just like I did Dale. That one night in '94. I'm gonna kill out there. It won't like delay the entire fight for it, but it will be funny if they say it. Now you see, me? you're gonna burn yourself out if you keep this up. America, love it or get your ass kicked, socialist. Yeehaw! You okay, Super Craig? Sure, I'm fucking fabulous. <laughs> Quite a sass, doesn't it? This mean I get to go back on disability? Hallelujah! Don't just take that lying down, butt boy. Never mind. Oh, whoop you like your daddy never done. You okay, human kite? Love how you just asked if they're okay, and then with me, he's like, "Oh, you're fine." Don't want to get to you. Oh, yes. Yes. Here I go. Mega Paul, look. You beat the crap out of them, dude. Good work. I don't need your praise, but thank you. <laughs> Let's mess with some physics. Way to move like you give a fuck. I really hope they ask it just at some point. Yeah. That sucks for you, new kid. Oh, thanks. So motivational a bit child when it comes to me and I get fuck all. Nice move. I watched the whole thing unfold like a multi-night TV miniseries event. Because that's how fast I am. <laughs> Everyone's a critic. Everyone's a critic. And stay down. It's my fucking turn, yeah. Mega this punch a roof. Are we done here? We're done. Right. Well, hello, new child. I haven't seen you before, but you come at a crucial time. South Park is sliding into moral decline. Mm -hmm. Someone's stealing our cats. They're TPing houses. Okay, maybe it's not full on Armageddon yet, but we do need a hero. Not to make the hard sell, but do you see yourself as a good person? Well, I can understand the confusion, but there comes a time when we need to choose our path. Will you find Jesus Holy and take shit. the righteous path? Or maybe you'll walk the middle way. 
Let's not talk about the third alternative. I'm hoping you're part of the solution, not the problem. Take the first step, my child, by entering this meditative chamber, which will allow you to confront your deepest fears. Face your fears, new child. Face your fears. <laughs> your dad fucked your mom. You afraid of the dark? Snakes? The color blue? Oh hey, I'm in your no, imagination. No, 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 no. Oh, I hate this fucking music. Oh, I guess this one likes it My stack of truth no, days. God, I remember one time I forgot to do it. I forgot to like do the thing offline. I had to. I streamed for six minutes before I went off and did that. I swear to God. Hmm. <laughs> Ew! No, gross. Got God's love here. Who am I gonna give it to? Fucking no one. Go to your fucking grave and give it to yourself. Good God, I hate you, uh, sir. Oh, I like that. Ew. Just let me get warmed up. Ew, let me get the fuck out of your way. Ow. Oh my. Ew. I'm full of God's grace and nowhere to put it. Oh my God, they're so gross. I don't deal with them. I can't progress though. So. <laughs> oh, they're so disgusting. God damn it! I can't put a child in a dark room for two minutes without you bastards showing up. Well, you're definitely going to hell now. Get out of here! That's not what the Queen Spider says. I'll go say 10 mil Harry's. Oh, God. Gosh, I feel just awful about all that. Tell you what, a rabbi mm. friend gave me this macaroni picture. In times of trouble and tribulation, use it to call upon the prophet Moses. Good luck on your spiritual journey, my child. God, Robin's like, she's my favorite character in Stranger Things, and people with their little opinions about her really piss me off. New kid, you've done a decent job so far. Come back to the coon layer. I think we should advance your character. Coon out. It's like opinions and theories, like they think. Does she fucking need to get somewhere fast? You kid. Like lied when she came out to Steve so she wouldn't hurt his feelings because you know she doesn't like him like that because she's a lesbian and they think she lied about like you know being a lesbian. See you, new kid. That's fucked up, honestly. Her and Steve are still close up though. I'd say it took him a minute to kind of come to terms with that, right? But then he did, and that was it. He just goes on to mess with her like usual. Okay, she hates it, but her phone screen would absolutely be cracked. But the question is... There we go, that's better. <gasps> no, not that fucking god-awful thing. You, mom. Oh, I hate that fucking thing. Ah, new kid, come take a seat. Okay. <laughs> All right, well, how's it going out there? Fucking horrific, and that's just your fucking loving room. Okay, good talk. Uh, well, listen, I think you show some potential, and uh, I'm gonna upgrade uh, you to somebody's sidekick or something. Congratulations. Oh my god, I. I, I mean, technically, Robin is, but okay. Bit. Your character sucks, to be honest, and. I, think I'm gonna I know, we didn't really get much Let's of a reaction to Eddie's to death. So I mean, well, Eddie died. We thought someone else also died. There was a two day Final time girl. skip. Final girl for the superhero who just won't die. Okay, I think those two but they did together. say there's now meant to be 
uh, repercussions from Eddie's death that we'll see in season five, but that's not for two years, so. But the reason you couldn't sleep was because you wanted to make the world a safer place. You walked to the mirror. Yeah, we walked to the mirror. Okay. You looked in the mirror and wondered if anyone would ever love you. <laughs> you heard a noise, but but it was a baby crying. If anyone would ever love you. Out in the I hallway, mean, you saw two guys we're pretty close with Robin saw. here, honestly. If anyone would ever love you. So you beat them. You swept the the only reactions we really rest. saw about Eddie were Dustin, because Dustin was there uh, when he died. So. I like it. I like it, yeah. I like it. Sorry, I like it. I do. I do. Yes. I know you probably want to know why. Why your dad fucked your mom, but those are answers you'll have to find for yourself. Oh my god. Oh, I remember when those fucking alerts would go off in everyone's house. They would wonder where the fuck they came from. What's happening? It's the Freedom Pals! What have they done now? Just get to Main Street! Hurry! We're coming! Coon! Ow! Well, new kid, looks like you might be needing those newfound powers. Follow me! Yeah, in a damn minute. Silently for a second for sorry fucking talking. It's creepy. Uh, God damn it. So close. Head towards Main Street, butthole, and gird your loins for battle. Yes, a little further. You know, you have kind of pretty hair. Oh my god. We were supposed to do it, but never twig. God, oh, Cartman. Kind of pretty like here. Friend, because you had your own movies. Thank God you're here. Take you're really going at it. Super Craig had to have movies before Wonder Tweak was introduced. It made no sense otherwise. Your whole group makes no sense. Because you're a traitor, Tweak, and now you're with a group of super traitors. This was started by you. By people who thought there should be preferential treatment to certain heroes. We aren't the ones who walked out of the fucking franchise, Mysterion. Eric, you must listen to me. Right now, I'm speaking to you telepathically. Get out of my head, Timmy. Your franchise is going nowhere. Face the truth, Eric. You guys are kind of douchebags. He just called us douchebags in my mind. He did? All right, you son of a bitch. <laughs> Motherfucker! Good friends, deal with these assholes! You're making a big mistake messing with Cunin, friends. Pass springs into action. Dude, pace yourself. Sorry, I forgot to unmute. I like, I like What's that, that as well. Sorry, I like that as well. Yeah. Lame. I don't hear lame. You're like the lamest lame of all time. That was lame too. Uh, quit trying so hard. I'm oh not. Okay. Oh shit! I might have attacked him too much. Prepare to meet your end. We need him to leak. You we can off, but Today, you cross I don't know if he has. That was some dark shit, man. Move! Fuck you, dude. It's civil war, dick. Clear. Yeah, duck. Clear. Did someone call for a fist in the face? Make a fist fight. Uh. You know, I'll probably be fine. Activate. 
ever get the feeling life is punishing you for being a dick, Tweak? Ah, oh, shit. I will right wrongs and triumph over evil! And that means you! Wait, me? Tweak hurt? What a surprise. Make way for Mysterion! No mercy. Yeah! Oh, Christ! I need a cup of coffee! My turn. Protect the innocent. Uphold the law. Oh well, bye Jimmy. Okay, well you know what? I try to keep all you stupid fuckers alive. It's not easy. That sucks for you. New kid's gonna kick your ass, freedom pal. No, you are. Not sure if you know, but hell hath no fury like wrath of fight. I gotta be fucking kidding me. Seriously. God, if everyone to cause me issues, of course it's you. Of course it's you. I'm not your worst nightmare. I aspire to be. You shouldn't make the butthole angry. So why are you trying to make me angry? Yeah, I'll be fine. Well, fuck that. What? On the wrong side of this new kid. God damn it, you motherfuckers! Thank you. Seriously, you're not making this easy, by the way. It's time. Yeah, they're Here gonna go. kill us. The oh, oh, you fucking assholes! I'm not sorry for what I'm about to do. See what I need to do now, probably. Oh, they're making it so more difficult. I feel a storm coming on. Supreme thunder. Oh. <laughs> you're grounded, tight. Think about what no. you're doing, you kid. Okay, well think about what you just made me fucking do, yeah, fucker. See, if you'd stuck <laughs> with where you were originally <laughs> meant to go, you could have just been fun, but now we have to say goodbye. Unbelievable. We got there in the end, okay? We're fine. Good job, new kid. You're really I have stuff with Morgan hey, wait, Freeman and that, that had like a lot oh, more deaths, so it was fine. Dude, what happened? Timmy got away? He, he completely raped my mind. You okay? No, seriously, you guys. He fucked the shit out of my brain. Yeah, he's uh, fine. I grabbed him. We fought for a little bit, but his, his mental powers are too strong. So we did all that for nothing? Not quite. I got Timmy's cell phone. You did? There's sure to be a lead on that. Let's get this back to base. Super Craig can analyze it. Mayor's office first. Uh, hello. Is this the little superhero who is getting all the followers on Instagram? Your presence is requested at City Hall. The mayor of South Park wishes to speak with you. Don't make her wait. Hello, young person. Hello. I'm the mayor of South Park. You must be very excited to be here. Well, all right, look. You might be able to help me. This new crime wave in town, it isn't a coincidence. Some group or someone is trying to make me look bad. The more crime goes up, the more hmm. people start calling okay. for my head. Whoever is behind this wants to see me get replaced. I need people like you. Please. Find out who is behind the crime wave in our town. My political life depends on it. Cancel all my meetings today. Uh, you don't. I'm not even bothering second round for that. It's like trying to say it always faster, Main Street or the church. 
here, pussy pussy. I'm just getting tired. Sorry, I'm getting tired. Fuck. I'm gonna end in about um. half an hour, okay? Thank God, oh, life and that home. fucking shit started. Alright, let's get to work. Alright. What have you found, Super I'll be back in a minute. Timmy's phone has a bunch of notes in it. Something about a girl who has information about all the criminal activity in town. What girl? It just says, find the girl with the dick tattoo. Well, what girl in town has a dick tattoo? I don't know, Mosquito, but the Freedom Pals must think she's the key to finding the missing cat. If the Freedom Pals find her before we do, they'll get the $100 reward. We cannot let that happen. We have to stop the Freedom Pals from having a sweet franchise, at all costs. Then we have to find the girl with that tattoo tonight. Fast Pass is right. We all have to sneak out of our houses tonight and search the entire town. What do you say, new kid? Are you up for it? Look, if you want to be a coon friend, you have to learn to communicate. Yeah. Who let this guy join us anyway? Go easy on him, you guys. He's had a tough life. When he was six years old, his dad fucked his mom. What? I'm sorry, friend, but it's time they learned your tragic backstory. Butthole doesn't trust anyone because his dad fucked his mom and he couldn't do anything to stop it. That doesn't make any sense. I know. How could the person you trust do that to the only other person you love? Carbon, everyone's dad fucked everyone's mom. Huh? That's how it works, stupid. Our dads fucked our moms. Oh, right. So does that mean your dad fucked your mom, Cam? Huh? Yes! My dad fucked my mom! That's why I'm here! Don't steal his backstory, dude. That's not cool. You're so fucking stupid! Every human alive on Earth had a dad who fucked their mom stop, and- Stop, stop! This is not what's important right now! We need to find the lady with the dick tattoo! Yeah, let's get home so we can prepare for evening mission. Let's go, coon friends! He's such a fucking idiot! It's okay, calm down. I'm afraid you'll have to deal with that kind of bigotry your whole life, butthole. When people don't understand, they lash out. I'm going to let you be a sidekick tonight to one of the coon friends. Go home and sneak out after your parents are asleep. I'll fill you in later. Hang on. I do like it, yeah. <laughs> you want some of this, Forthy? What's wrong, Forthy? Chicken? Yeah, Robin does seem like the type of person to do that. She's a runner. She runs away from shit like this. Even talking to the school counselor. Why'd you answer the phone? Have you lost your fucking mind? Our child felt the need to go talk to the school counselor. Doesn't that bother you at all? So you told him the truth? 
Yes, I said she's a girl. You dumb bitch! You'll ruin everything! I don't have to listen to Just a blunt, I said Friday. she's a girl. I need a drink. Sure, drown your problems in Chardonnay, you stupid skank. Oh, hey, whippersnapper. Have a fun day out playing? <laughs> well, I'm exhausted. Gonna get ready for bed. Dinner's on the table if oh, you want. Oh yeah, come. sure. But then straight to bed, okay? Gonna get ready for bed Hot and then head. come downstairs Alcoholic. and get high and drunk and fuck knows what else. <laughs> you know, for someone who got like the whole powers thing. From the medicine mixed in with it. You don't eat much of the food. I'm just saying. Alright, sleepy sleep time. Sweetie, I just want you to know that whatever happens, mommy always loved you. Good night, sweetheart. Mm. That time, that's when the creeps come out. But unfortunately for the creeps, the other thing that comes out at night is a king. Is the Dustin Henderson of this game? Like, if I had to pick anyone, it's it's definitely him. Hmm. All right, but if not, nice talking to you. Bye. Follow me. Ready? Let's go, sidekick. Kyle's his wife. I'm pretty much like Bruce Banner. A loner, hoping to one day cure my diabetes, and yet knowing it means I'll no longer be able to fight crime. Fuck a bitch! Oh my god. See how you like this! Real nice, right there. Real nice. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Well, move out of the way, huh? I need to go buy some more beer. I'm sorry, but Captain Diabetes cannot let you drive. I'm fine to drive, okay? Get out of here! Hey, give me my keys! You are not give him the keys. I'm fine, okay? Look, wait, look, look. I'm fine. Okay? Give me my keys, please. I'll return them tomorrow. Give me my fucking keys, you little shit! Think I can dance with this? Let's go! Sometimes I forget I did, like, an Take Umbrella care, Academy, like, rewrite after well. season well, one to make it kind of better. And then I'll get like someone will find it and like it and I'll get an email about that. I'm keeping your keys and that's final. We can all go to the store together. You two drive. I will not break the lock, sir. If you're on like archive of our own, they always like email you if somebody's left a kudos on your story. Oh god, I'm poop. You're no match for Captain Diabetes and you crusty sidekick. Alright, you're gonna get it now! Whoa, 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 how'd I end up over here? Ah, damn it! I'll hold him off, that hit! <laughs> Fuck me! I'm not even buzzed anymore! What do you say you just give me those keys? No can do, Mr. Rush! Ah. Alright, that's it. You know what to fucking do. Show them what you're made of, Snack You show them what you're made of. I'll get those keys 
just right after this short little nap. Good night, Mr. Mark. Weird. Like going to the cinema today. I wasn't sure if I'd enjoy it because I've got still got my whole um. I don't have a serious thing with Ian. But like now, it's like when I want to have like something fun, like something chocolate or something. This doesn't happen a lot, but sometimes I'll have this little this voice in my head telling me that I shouldn't do it because. I've convinced my myself that I shouldn't do it or something. That's why I have diabetes. I don't think that's why I have diabetes, though. I think it was a gift to help fight crime. This shortcut will take us right into the heart of downtown South Park. I'm like, I don't like having that voice there. It doesn't come up often, on, just... It just comes up sometimes, and then I feel like shit. Cause then I feel like, well, maybe I just don't deserve chocolate at all. Like, it sucks, sucks, and sucks. Cause I don't know. You don't think people get diabetes because their mom started doing diabetes, do you? I feel like that I treated myself today. I mean, I didn't touch like half the half the stuff I bought, but I ate the popcorn. I ate roughly um. A little less than half the bag, so. Anyway, sorry, sorry. I love the way they run, just kind of little hops. Here it is. Here's where we're going to find the girl. There are sure to be unsavory characters and lots of boobies inside. Come on, cool. let's go inside. Sorry, I'm breaking. Gonna be on the next. 15 minutes roughly. Hey, beat it, kids. 21 and over only. Okay, bye. Turn this eye, citizen. It is I. Top this diabetes. I must speak with the ladies inside. Get out of here before I fucking throw you out. Hmm. What to do? Hmm. There must be another way in somewhere. And up. Uh, now we just need a way up there. Over here, sidekick. I have an idea. Oh, of course. Stand aside, sidekick.
back when you're 21 and I'll let you suck on my implant. I got some new stock, Hellraiser. You clearly enjoy the finer things. Cheers, big guy. You listen to that CD yet? Some good stuff on there. Let's do this. This is Robin and FM Steve! That's funny for me. Hey, you two girls ready to party? So this is your friend, huh? She's fucking hot as oh fuck. God. Wouldn't you like to take her to VIP? I don't know, she's kind of short. I like them short. You take the one with the speech impediment. Come on, let's get some dance. Don't forget to bring the <laughs> Look, I'm not gonna pay for this. What kind of move was that? Oh, come on, you're killing my buzz here. Oh, Ray! This is major shaking up the VIP room. Oh, I'm gonna throw up. Oh, no! Oh, fuck! God, that sucked. Okay, chat time. Chat time? Oh man. So, what kind of work do you guys do? And have you ever danced with a girl here who has a penis tattoo? Why do you keep talking about a stripper with a penis tattoo? Yeah, yeah, Classy, that's her name. Her name is Classy? Yeah, Classy with an I and a little dick that hangs off the C which fucks the L out of the ASS. Of course. Hence the tattoo. We have the name, new kid. Come on. What are you talking about? This is the worst VIP experience ever. Yeah, all I did was get farted on. You ain't going nowhere. Haha, I am the ordinary stripper. I am Captain Diabetes. What? My sidekick and I simply used our powers of disguise to extract information from you. Yeah. Get away with this, Captain Diabetes. <laughs> oh shit, my boner is weighing me down. Yeah, all I did was get farted on. Oh my god, you're both so fucking disgusting. Rex. That's the last time I pay for a high-priced twenty-dollar stripper. I know oh a girl in Cambodia that'll give you a job and teach you how to kickbox for the price of one. Oh God, I'm dealing with yours. You deal with mine. Dance. Anyone like a dance? That could actually let me help. I'm gonna call the Better Business Bureau and tell them you can only save me half a chunk. The nerve of that feeling. The nerve. I wanna go to one of the. Oh. You got your dance, you smelly old man. Don't be good. Ah. Ah. Ha, these guys are no match for nice. us. Nice. Oh, thank you. You get a chop. What the nerd, Psychic? Come on, Pam. You need a manager if you have any complaints about your life. No, why am I so flattered by that ship and that's my sidekick? Drink for the DJ. Next up on the main stage, we've got a little bit of hot sauce coming up your way. Let's give it up for Esmeralda. That's it. The DJ calls the bitches names, and then the bitches come out of that back room. Nuke, we need to find a way to distract the DJ. I got it. Gin and tonics always make my mom pass out. If we can make one and spike it with something really strong, he'll be out for sure. Go make that drink, sidekick. Give it up for Drink. Ah, that looks kind of dangerous. Ah, that looks like a good sidekick. Let's keep looking. Perfect 
addition to our concoction. when I do the whole like fight in the strip first thing but I think after that we're gonna be done. I mean, he did great uh, as, like, an impressionist. clear a room of these bitches in about five minutes. Yeah, let's go. Stay after me, lady! Stop them! Nobody's allowed back here. Yeah, get lost. Stand aside, ladies. Captain Diabetes and his sidekick need to question that stripper. You want to get to her? You're going to have to go through us. Bring it on! Oh, bring it on, bitches. Alright guys, this is your DJ back from the- Bathroom, looks like we've got a special treat for you tonight. The two assholes that farted in my drink are about to get fucked in the face by our very own lovely ladies. Fuck me, Rev- I was counting on you! Okay, you know what? It's fine. I fucked up the one thing I was trying to do, but it's fine. Give it up for Paris. Ooh la la, need I say more yet? We got to catch class. Down the hallway, side quick, quickly. Here comes our favorite flower, Felatio. Give it up for Fuchsia. You can't stand up to my crusty tactic. Yes. 
Star Hand. Shit, that son of a bitch just broke my cuff nail. Stop them fucking cops already. Did it just get a lot spicier in here? Oh, that's why it's Esmeralda. Wow, your lady sucks. There's no reason for this to get ugly. Take a little eye. Yeah, honey cop got me all messed up. You got me real mad now. And subbing in from the day shift, give it up for Blaze. Hey, can we turn the house lights down just a touch? We can't let her get away, Sidekick! Stand back, Sidekick! I'll take care of this! Hey! Uh, Mama's mad now, sugar. Oh, you little bastards done fucked up! Go get him, Bootay! Look out, ladies and gents, here comes the queen of creepies, the mistress of BDSM, your dominatrix dream come true. It's spontaneous Bootay! Hey, honey, you ain't ready for this Bootay. I'm gonna crush you in my booty cheeks. I'm gonna break every bone in your body with my booty, baby. No, no, no. You never forget your first stripper, right, sidekick? My turn, bitches. It's boot time. Ugh. Here comes death by spontaneous boot Again. Uh-uh, you'll never take me alive! 
Finally. You win this time, honey. I'm gonna go rest my bootay. God, no, I'm exhausted. There we go. Alright, so I'll be back tomorrow in Minecraft.